Alrighty, there's the stream started up. I'll, um. I'll yep. get everything uh, sorted here. Wait for Twitch to register that I'm actually uh, live. Live. phone you don't need to tell me believe me I know I know categories we change to <laughs> don't forget to change your category yeah. where's an evil two that going. There we go. All right. Me and the viewer is one. Hello. There we go. Uh, I mean, the view is probably just me. Yeah, it's, it's just me. Uh, there we go. I think the view is D's. Alright, so this should be pretty easy. I'll just wait around and see if anyone hops oh, in. Huh. I turned on low latency mode. Hopefully that'll actually. You know, I I need to pee. I should totally go to the bathroom before I started the stream. But no, instead he's gonna leave me with yeah. the. Uh, so I'm gonna leave you with the audience. <laughs> yeah. It's no point. It's COVID test and stuff set up first. Oh uh, yeah, that's kind of important. See, it's funny because we have no viewers right now. Oh, we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Just gonna keep playing Archives. Actually, I think I might have signed these, I'm not gonna do that, but. Hey, Ori Rock Cluster? Ori Rock Cluster? Yeah, store, credit store. Oh, come on, I need one credit to buy shit. <laughs> it's really irritating, actually. Fuck it. Can I make one Ori Rock cluster? Not even close. Let's make as much polyester as I can, though. Let's just do that. Media. Oh, sorry, meteorite. Talking to yourself. Yeah, I was just talking aloud about what I was doing in Arc Nights. Yeah, what were you doing? Uh, making polyester packs. <laughs> ah, I see. Riveting, I know. I still need eight more. It's okay. I need one more Aurora Rock Cluster, and then the. Chips. Oh no, chip packs even. I actually sure. didn't mention any, anything about the streams in Kenzie's server. Kenzie's server? Uh, that's his server, not mine. Let me try. What extras do I have? Okay, I've got everything. Like, of course I have everything. Why wouldn't I? The Tofu Survivor. I'm not doing the fucking Tofu Survivor. Why not? <laughs> Dude, the Tofu Survivor sucks. Yeah, but you get all the different tofus. 
don't. Hunk? I don't really want the hunk? tofu. Yeah, hunk. Hunk on God? Yeah. Men real. Did, did you not realize? I mean, I figured, but like, men. No, no, I've got. You get a bunch of stuff for all the different models in the game. Who's he voiced by again? Keith Silverstein. Keith Silverstein. Remind me who he is. Uh, he was Speedwagon. He was uh, Reinhardt, I believe. Yeah, Reinhardt. Ah, uh, yes, Reinhardt from that game that I played. Listen, I'm trying to remember. He was. Uh, he's done a lot of things, but nothing else comes to mind because I'm forgetful. But I'll go look into it because I'm curious. All right. Keith Silverstein. Probably shouldn't like scroll through most of this stuff just because it's all like immediate spoilers. But nah, so be it. What other like bonuses are there? Cause I know there's like. Oh yeah, he's Vector the Crocodile. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking based Vector the Crocodile. He was Johann Liebert. Holy shit, that's that's some range. Uh, explain for those of us who are not weeb. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's fair. Listen, I didn't watch Monster. It's a it's a, it's a classic anime, apparently. It's, I it's yeah. yeah. Anyway, uh, let's uh, see. These are all tofu survivor achievements. Tofu. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm I'm, I'm still <laughs> Cookie Run Kingdom. Oh, they put that guy in Cookie Run Kingdom. Okay. Uh, that guy. <laughs> you can tell I don't care. Oh yeah, he was in Jujutsu Kaisen. Jujutsu Kaisen, who yeah. is? He's that. He's the fucking guy everyone simps for in Genshin. <laughs> That's not very specific. The one with the flat ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, so that's why I don't have Leon's classic, or his costume. It's because I never beat Leon's story on hardcore. Because every time I try to beat Leon's story on hardcore, I just kind of stop halfway through for no real reason. He was in Doom Eternal. Yeah, okay. Chairman Rose. Have I never beaten? I have I gotten S rank on. I guess I haven't gotten an S rank on either story. No, I haven't gotten any S ranks. That's surprising. That's nah. It's not surprising. I don't. Nah. Destroy all the Mister Raccoons. Yeah. Fuck that. I've I missed one file. We gotta I, find it. Yeah, we won't. <laughs> oh no. Oh, right, I typically leave behind one of the Matilda pieces, but what? I, uh, I just fan, I saw this and I'm like, oh. Oh, yeah, oh, fucking oh, Hunter oh. Hunter. Oh. Uh, it's not loading the rest of the rolls. I've only gotten through 2021 to 2019. Oh, it loaded. Simon Belmont. Call of Duty Black Ops 4. Okay. Okay, buddy. Fill the cartridge in the drug testing lab in eight moves. <laughs> Open the jail's electronic cell door in 13 moves. Oh yeah, he was Mondo! What the fuck is wrong with me? Oh. Oh yeah! Nah, like, whatever. We have we, society has progressed past the need for Danganronpa. It did the moment it came out. <laughs> Kill five enemies with a spark shot. <laughs> Is that how fr infrequently I use that piece of shit weapon? Wow. Kill two enemies at once with a single bullet or shotgun blast. Yeah, that's not surprising. Kill three enemies at once with a sub weapon. I could probably do that. I could clear out Legless PD with a, a grenade, I guess. Okay, I got my characters mixed up. He was Torbjorn in Overwatch, not Ryan. Ah, Ryan was something okay. else. My bad, my bad. Using the photo hints, find two hidden items. No, I don't think I will. Using the what? <laughs> uh, I already forgot. Uh, the photo... What? Oh, yeah, so you know the little rolls of film you can find? Mm -hmm. They so Some of them will point towards like little hidden secrets. Yeah, but yeah. I didn't realize that was like an achievement. Yeah, there's an achievement for actually utilizing it, and I don't. Yeah, we're just gonna wait for a, yeah, a, body, well. a body to hop in. I'm just saying it so it's in the box. Oh yeah, uh, no one's like actually viewing right now, so I'm not gonna start the game. Yeah. But 
We're just gonna wait for one of, one of my buddies. Wait, yeah, one of our friends. Oh well, yeah, one of my friends, I guess. <sighs> we'll get there. <laughs> oh, we'll get there. But not right now. God, the music is so ominous when you hover over it. Holy <laughs> shit. It's like, oh shit, it's Are the Are you bad ready one. for the worst one? Is that really, like, the only outfits that... I could totally have like bought an outfit. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, or you could have you could totally could have modded something. Yeah, but you know. What are we gonna mod? What are we gonna change? Uh, something in RE3. We were gonna mod someone in. I don't remember. No, who. no, no. My idea was that uh, we would start the Resident Evil Three stream, and it would just be RE2 modded to have Jill instead. Oh yeah, and then Mister. <laughs> Would and then Mr. Nemesis. X would be Nemesis, and then we would just play through some of RE2, and then I'd finally be like, okay, fine, we're gonna play the worst game. <laughs> oh my god. Um, granted, if I beat Resident Evil 2 like that, that would probably take longer than Resident Evil 3. It would probably be a time loss to pr play the wrong game instead of the right one. <laughs> but it would be more fun. It would be more fun. Uh, view your game completion results. Yeah. Christ. I... There's no way this is my best time, right? No, I, that's your best time. Cool. So that's how you get an S, is you, get, you do it yeah, three and a half hours. three and a half hours or less. Except, you know... <laughs> this? It changes. The game will change the goalpost, depending. What's, what's the number on the... Oh, is that the files? What is that? This? Yeah. Oh, uh, that's uh, saves. Oh, I'm gonna save. the amount of times you saved the game. You saved a lot during that Leon run, huh? Yeah. I, I refuse to believe that's Because, like, look at all of these. <laughs> look at all of my saves. I've got so many save slots. I play this game so often. Yeah, but look at how many of them are Leon and how many of them are Claire. Uh, one, two, three, four, five Leon. Six Leons and one, two, three, three Claire's, yeah. I typically do Leon's story because I prefer Mr. X to G, but, you know, what of it? So we're starting with Claire A? Yeah, we're doing Claire A and Leon B. You know what, we'll just let Kirby decide. He's going to be the only person in the stream. We'll let him choose what he wants first. I don't care. Uh. <laughs> like, I know we did, like, a poll in, like, our server, and I'm pretty sure they picked Leon A, Claire B, but, like, they're not watching. Yeah, they really don't. They really, they really aren't. don't be the ones watching this or playing it. So like, I don't really care. <laughs> like, at least Sophia has an excuse yeah. that she's flying to Hawaii. Yeah, she's literally not capable of watching. And also, everyone else has, you know, like school. <laughs> Some of them. Yesterday was a Sunday, bro. Oh, well, today's a Monday. I wouldn't have wanted to watch RE2 either. Oh, I can see. I can see when I make some noises that the mic just fucking goes way past red. It's just like, hmm, stop. Hmm, baby, stop making noise. Yeah, if, if you if you be too loud, it'll show you that it's peaking, which is nice. <laughs> uh, it's nice because it's useless information because I don't act on it. <laughs> I just continue to make the noise. You know, fuck it, let's look at the st Actually, no, we can look at the online store here. Um, let me... Yeah. Well, <laughs> it just opened the Steam store. <laughs> I don't know. What, 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 what outfits do they got for purchase? I could buy the 98 outfit. The, the, the 98 outfits are free. Uh, there's the noir outfits. And by that I mean there's Noir Claire, because Noir, Noir Leon sucks. Yeah. <laughs> he just looks... He looks... I, he just looks like Tommy Angelo from Mafia. He does. He, he does just look like Tommy. Which, like... No thanks. <laughs> I already played... We, we, well, I didn't play. We already experienced Mafia yeah, 1. So I, I already played. played Mafia 1. It sucks. Don't bother. <laughs> but... And this is coming from the biggest fan of Mafia 2. I love Mafia 2. It's one of my favorite games of all time. I think it's an incredible story. I think it's an incredible game. I hated Mafia 1. It was so boring. And it didn't run at all. It, it did everything in its power to not let me play it. And I'm not exaggerating that at all. 
Maybe if I ran it on this computer, now that I'm here in America, it would run better? It probably would. But, I don't want to. I already beat it once. I don't want to play it again. It was boring. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. I wanted to check out what the weekly challenge was, and it just fucking booted in the Steam overlay. Select your date of birth... Fine, you have my date of birth. If you sell it to people, though, I'm gonna be pissed. I want my cut. Uh, all right. What well, what are the what are the weeklies for Resident Evil Two? <laughs> um, kill no more than three enemies. <laughs> In the tofu challenge. In the tofu challenge or the fourth survivor. Um, In the story. In the story, pick up no more than a hundred items on standard or hardcore and. No shotgun or grenade launcher, and no sub-weapons on hardcore. That's fucking terrible. Once you get to the labs, you're literally just gonna have to deal with instant death enemies without the th means to kill them. <laughs> That's so stupid. Presumably it's, like, a randomly generated... Thing. Oh yeah, it is absolutely randomly generated. But, the labs are still gonna fucking suck. Because the only way to kill Ivies is... Uh, okay. As Claire... The only way to kill Ivy's as Claire uh, is with the grenade launcher. Claire doesn't get any other means of uh, explosive. Uh, sorry, of f fire. Uh, so Leon's chilling in this challenge, despite the fact that he doesn't have s sub weapons. Like that's also stupid. Uh, but we're moving past that. Claire fucked. Once you get into the labs, you cannot d deal with the Ivy's. You're gonna have to like temporarily knock them down and then on your way out you're gonna have to be chased by like eight of like, them all at once and if they grapple you you're just dead i can't believe how many people do these challenges oh yeah people like this game <laughs> oh complete all challenges this week to earn a platinum medal uh what do they do uh what are the medals for Nothing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, okay. Any play data that uses aim assist will not be counted. Yeah, I, I hate console players too, actually. <laughs> Granted, like, I don't think this game's difficult enough to warrant needing aim assist, but, you know, that's because I'm good at it. <laughs> I'm not going to judge anyone who uses aim assist. I don't need tutorials. The laser dot sight? Is there a laser sight in this game? I mean, clearly. Yes, yes there is. You get the, uh, I believe it's, is it the Samurai Edge? Uh, you, you can get a second pistol as uh, Claire and Leon. I think you can get it as both. I, it's, I think for Leon, no. I think for Claire, it's in the trunk of the police car in the car, uh, the car garage. Mm-hmm. Um, the parking garage. I think it's in the trunk of the police car is Claire, but then for Leon, that's the Matilda uh, three-round burst stock, which sucks. But, yeah, I, I guess there is a fucking red dot site. I completely forgot that was even a thing. Uh, audio should be fine. We got subtitles. My graphics... My, I can handle this game. Don't worry. Just don't question the red, the red number. It's, it's fine. <laughs> RE nut. Oh yeah, you know, do you know what engine this game is on? No, I'm not. This is on the RE engine. Oh, yeah. it's on its own engine. No, it's not the Resident Evil engine. What? Well, what is it? Uh, I don't remember what it stands for. It's... Yeah, it's the Reach for the Moon engine. Don't ask where the E yeah, in RE where, comes where from. Is the, where is, where, where R -E is the E? R -E Where's the E? There's an E! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the RE engine is the Reach for the Moon engine, but there's no second E. Other than the, f the first E in Reach, that's the only E in Reach for the Moon. You know what? <laughs> it's a fucking stupid name. Like, you know that they only named it that because of Resident Evil, but, like, it's still... 
I don't know, dude. It, 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 it's an engine. <laughs> Extra modes. Ah, fuck it. I'll try fourth survivor once. Oh shit, I'm getting fed today, boys. <laughs> For those who don't know, I'm a fucking gay, simple idiot. You can't say that on Twitch. Oh, no, I can't say that on Twitch. It's fine. It's fine, there's no viewers to tattle on us. This is Nighthawk. Come in, Alpha. Alpha, do you read? Nighthawk, this is Hunk from Alpha Team. Man, I thought you were all wiped out. I've been trying that to- point, Kate. I need to turn the brightness up. <laughs> what? Well, I didn't even see a pattern. Good. <laughs> oh my god, go, go back to it. Go back to the brightness real quick. Okay, that's so much better. I can see the I, I just, I just, brightness. Look at look at it on the other monitor. So, yeah, you know, it's because this monitor is Ethan's, and it's made for, like, quality, so the brightness on it is set to an optimal setting that makes things not look washed out. Funny, I can't fucking see. Yeah. <laughs> Need info on my extraction. I guess there's no keeping down the Grim Reaper, huh? My extraction point. Relax, Mr. I'm headed toward the front gate of RPD. Pick you up there. Yeah. All right, just run past him. I don't... Well, uh, oh. Oh, I... oh no, no, is a side. The punk is a lot of fun. Oh, yeah. What do you mean, no nos? I, I said the no no word. He said, oh, no, no word. There's a lot of those for Twitch. Good point. Listen, I'm sorry. I won't say it again. If I remember, I'll do my best. Alright. Point is, the hunk is great. I oh, have, yeah. He, he's memories. fun. I have good memories of the fourth survivor. It's but fucking hard, dude. It is. The first time we played this, there was a thunderstorm in my, like, in my area, and I was shook to my core. I was really scared. Why? Thunderstorm. I didn't like it. it oh, yeah, you're afraid of lightning. It was really, it was like a really, really bad one, and so I was really scared. But then we played the Fault Survivor, and I was like, wow, who it's the guy? And I thought, oh, oh, shit. No. Ah, this is, uh, actually, this is fine because I'm not going to. Well, this is no longer fine. I need that knife. I need that. It's fine. I, I will be fine. I just gotta get through this door and I'll be fine. Alright. Um, I always forget. I think... Yeah, I'd rather have shotgun shells than anything else. Do you get loot? I don't You start with this shit, but you don't get anything else. I think... This is the wrong way. Yeah, this is the wrong way. Oh, sh I was looking at the stream. It's fine. Uh, I need to shoot that. I can go past these guys. Uh, nope, I literally cannot. Um, okay. Actually, this might be good for me. I might get an achievement for that. Yes, it did. That's the only reason I did it, because I might have gotten the achievement. Zombie right Don't worry, I'll keep an eye on the chat. Yeah, alright. Um, I'll, I'll have that sub weapon out. Just because it's, you know, reclaimable. Yeah, this is only open for hunk. Well, that's not true. I think you can. Yeah, you can open this as the others, but it takes a very long time. I fucking hate these guys, but, you know. Is that what I think they are? I hate them too. That should, should not have grabbed him. His animation is over. Whatever. I'm not getting that back. I just gotta move past.
Uh, they're spitting out G younglings, but it's fine. I'm faster than they are. That guy will not get up in time. Yeah, that's right. We have to go up the elevator. No, we don't go up the elevator? God damn it, I got stuck on geometry, so I'm still getting used to movement in this game. Alright, that's fine. I've got healing items. If I wasn't injured, that I don't think would have hurt me as much. Oh, th I'm stupid. I got mixed up on my elevators. I wouldn't. I won't make that mistake in the campaign. Alright, so that mistake cost me the health spray, but... Yeah, I don't mind. It's just a flashbang. They're all blind. No, they're not. I'm taking them. This room sucks. I always lose something in here. Do I have to go through? I think going through there is a waste of time. I don't think I can. Well, we'll see. Yep, I do indeed have to. I don't know why they make you go this way. You can't go this way uh, during the main campaign. This path, path gets blocked off after the first fight with G. First fight. Yeah. Oh, I hate it. Ah, fuck me. And nope, not enough. That's ah, dead. I completely forgot about that animation. I completely forgot there was even a liquor there. This guy doesn't stand up in time either. This guy can grab, but he doesn't tend to. I think there's going to be another liquor here. Hey yo, just want to join. I presume it's Kirby, but if it's not, hello. The dog's the only real concern. fourth survivor. It's not actual, like, important or anything. Yeah, I'm just playing it for the fun of it. This is bonus. Uh, I get grabbed by this guy. I, I, I need to be a bit more lenient with my sub-weapon from now on, which means I don't use it here. I need to get more kills. From here on out, I just play it safer. Uh, I didn't even see him. That'll kill me if it doesn't. If I don't do that. Come on, there we go. I don't even know what that noise is. I don't think the looker even would have killed me. I think that was a waste of my grenade. Alright, well, this is the next problem. I don't think I can go in here. No. Hi, hi. Yo, just playing the fourth survivor. This isn't any important thing. Oh, right. God. I forgot about you. Yeah. With being in this. And, oh, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if you don't use the magnum there, I think you have to. Wait, he could have grabbed me again? Alright, whatever. It's fine. You're here now, so we can just do the actual campaigns. Oh man. No, oh, fuck what survivor. It's fun. It's hard. It's fine, I got the achievement. Alright. So Kirby, you get to make a choice here. You 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 get to pick which uh story we do first. I don't care. I've done every single possible route in this game. So are we playing as Leon first or Claire first?
console notifications. Yeah. yeah. While you decide, I will get the live split set up. Uh, I, I literally don't have like a convenient place to put the live split anywhere on my my monitors because I actually have this game full screened. But while I'm doing that as well, I want to. Yeah, pull up that just in case I need to change anything. There we go. All right. In case you didn't hear Kirby, you get to pick which story we do. Let's see. All right. So, yeah. It doesn't matter. You, we, we can do either one. Whichever one that we do now, we're gonna do the other one. All right. So we'll do Claire A and Leon B. All right. Yeah. So let me just. Uh, all right. Perfect. Uh, it's a waste of a second there. I just gotta make sure that I've got access to it. I just. Like, you'd want to see this. Yeah. All right. So uh, I'll hit enter and then. Just hit one, and if we end up wasting time as a result, I don't care. All right, standard. Look, man, I'm serious, okay? So oh, the burger! Yeah, the burger. The dumbest thing I've ever seen in a video game. Tell us a story, tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up, I'm going to put my camera. Oh, come on. It's just getting good. He doesn't sound like this. I understand. <laughs> oh, by the way, stream should be on low latency mode. So there should be less stream to less. Sleep. Oh shit. So, I've played this game too many times. <laughs> uh, I had, what was it, like... 50 hours? I have 50 hours in this game. We don't need no tutorial. <laughs> I could... Hello? I, I could probably speedrun this game if I really, Are like, here? learn stuff. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. Claire, Claire is absolutely wonderful, and I love her so much. <laughs> Shame the franchise doesn't. Hello?
Are you okay? Wait here. I'll check it out. Uh, so I will give you a bit of a warning about this game. It has very intense gore. If you're not good with gore, maybe don't pay full attention to what's gonna happen sometimes. Excuse me, is everything okay? Stay back, ma'am. I got this. Don't come any closer. Right. Oh, let me just miss my shots real quick. I'm a I'm a fucking god gamer. Oh, you only get five shots, that's right. <laughs> um fuck. I don't remember where you actually I hate collapses. I don't actually remember where you get the key. It's been too long since I played this game. What uh what is Claire's job again? Do we know? Claire is nineteen years old. Oh yeah, she's just nineteen. She doesn't have a job, I don't think. Can't be alive. I'm just like, damn, she she had a gun for Oh yeah, she has a gun. You don't need a job to have a gun. I mean I know that. Welcome to America, baby. Saves Leon in his story. Very. Even. Yeah, it's it's yeah, it's yeah, it's, yeah. it's it's a, a two-way street. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later when we're safe. Holy shit! Time for my favorite wooden board, Leon. <laughs> <laughs> this dude is an oak log. Like I love Leon. His voice sounds. Come on! Get in! <laughs> Hold on. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, that's not gonna happen in this game. Don't worry though, I think it happens in another one. Oh yeah, we have to get a title card. We have to speed! Full speed! I literally don't remember this. <laughs> it's been so long since I saw like this part. I don't I don't think I've ever not skipped it other than the first time I played this game. I didn't skip it when we you showed it to me for the first time. No? Yeah. Alright, well. Oh shit. Wait, I see Yoshi Kanda. I know who that is. Maybe I don't. Maybe I'm making shit up. Yeah, maybe. Who knows? I know Kanda's the guy from Yakuza 3. Kanda? I think. Which one? Uh, There's a few guys from Yakuza 3. He's a big man. The oh, of... yeah. Attention, all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Why is Sheriff spaced so weirdly? She riff. Like we're walking from here. More like running. Yeah, good. 
Capcom. You okay? Yeah, I'm all right. How about you? I can't stay here. It's not safe. Oh, shit. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station. All right. So now we're playing a video game. Can't stop. Gotta keep moving. Am I going the right way? I don't think I am. Why is that guy even there if I'm not supposed to go in that direction? Just so you can see a USB-C zombie? I guess. It's like the end of the world. I think some wizard just cast fireball and missed us. <laughs> Did we anger a wizard? Oh shit. <laughs> Almost there. Zombie wizard is kind of funny. Otherwise known as a, a fruity zombie. <laughs> Here we are. The place we're going to spend the next here? two hours. Speed loader. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Where are you? Oh, shit. They're inside, too. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. Send reinforcements! East hallway! I should help this guy. This dude. Yeah, this, this station is laid out, that's for sure. Oh yeah, uh, they try to explain it, and it doesn't work. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the explanation is that this place used to be like a museum, and that absolutely does not explain how confusing it is in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> it certainly looks like a museum. Well yeah, but just because a place is a museum doesn't mean that it's like oh, confusing yeah, no, I know. bullshit. Like I this game. have finally learned the layout of this place. Alright, hold on. Extent. Let me see if I remember the safe code here. I think it's 6 to 11. <laughs> I literally can't use this for like an hour and a half. <laughs> It's like, that was a complete waste of time. But it's okay, because it, it's cool. Because I got to show off. 
because I I'm not using a guide and I have no evidence of that, but um, I'm not. <laughs> I feel like the evidence is when you used a guide, I read it out to you in detail yesterday. <laughs> yeah, true. The, the the downside is I don't actually quite recall the safe in Legless. Uh, I don't remember the combo for that. Legless. Yeah, I've got a lot of terminology for this game that you just kind of have to get used to. Um, you'll, you'll get used to them. You'll, you'll understand them pretty quickly. But yeah, no, I don't even... I mean, okay, one... To be fair, the city did have an over-budget for the police, considering stars literally exists. Eh, I'm not gonna need that, or... Eh, I'll, I'll, nah, oh, fuck first aid sprays. All my homies hate first aid sprays. So true! Uh, so yeah, no, the city did have an over-budget for the police, but that's not why this place is stupid bullshit. It just is. <laughs> zombie never gets up. This is a safe room. To an extent. Enemies can come in here, but eh, you're pretty safe even if they do. Oop, that's right. Right. Yeah, this place is empty. nothing behind that. That'll be later. First aid spray. There's nothing in this one, but you know, if you're interested, you can see a toilet overflowing. So here's a real Hurry door up. warning. all my shots. Alright, you know what? Get them to come in here. I can dodge around them. So you might be wondering why uh, you don't shoot... I'm not shooting them in the head. As good as it doesn't do much. You're not gonna kill them. You're just not. You can, but you're not going to. Uh, Crimson Heads are not a concern in this game. Uh, thank fuck. It was in the original Resident Evil 2, but not in this remake. Uh, but if you shoot them in the head, you have a, you're not going to kill them. It takes a lot of shots or a critical hit to kill them. Uh, whereas, if you shoot them in the legs, uh, you can destroy their leg and force them to crawl, which makes them very, very, uh, not only weak, slow, but also they have very, very short range, which is what you need. You just need them to have shorter range and then they're fine. All right. Yeah. You're safe. For now. <clears throat> Marvin Brown. Thanks. 
Obviously, someone taught you well. Yeah. I know how to take care of myself. Come on. <clears throat> Time for one of the best characters in Resident Evil history. So nobody knows what caused this? There's a lot of theories. But all I know for sure is that this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah, it's on me. Hey, hey, keep that on. Just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. He left weeks ago. Vacation? That's... That's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. <gasps> hey. <sighs> yeah, we should probably get you to a hospital. Oh, no. Forget about me. I can take care of myself. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're gonna need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. Now. You probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're gonna... Shh. And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can. Or you run. Uh, yes, we have first aid sprays, but Marvin does not have uh, any T-virus immunity. Uh, the, the canon explanation is, for the most part, most of the player characters have some sort of in, just genetic uh, resistance to the T-virus, which most people don't have. Um, Jill Valentine is a very, very special example in that she's got a very developed immune system for most of the viruses in this game because she's been through so fucking much. Uh, however, she uh, also does contract the T-virus in Resident Evil 3. Um, so on the topic of headshots, just because I'm not shooting them in the head does not mean headshots are weak. Uh, it means that it's weak with the pistol. <laughs> uh, once we get better weapons, uh, and by that I mean we're not going to if we're playing as Claire, but once we're playing as, um, Leon, we'll get a shotgun and, uh, a magnum, and those deal, those can kill with a headshot in, like, one shot. Uh... Claire will not be getting that. You do get magnum rounds for her, but we won't be able to use them since until the sewers, which is a long way from now. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. What? Who's there? Why did she look? Alright, so that guy's head is destroyed. I I don't know. So she does have girl boss immunity. So oh yeah, true. absolutely. Just oh. like Jill. All the women in this game have girl boss immunity. Uh, well, nah. I don't get any boards. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do myself a favor. Alright, I'm gonna do that now. If I don't do that now, I'm gonna forget to do it later when I'm being chased by a liquor. <laughs> Record of events. It's it's stuff. Things happen. Uh, zombies are in the station. If you want to read everything, uh, that's not what I'm here for. <laughs> All right, it's time. Uh, no, I should do some other things first. All right, so what's the code? It's like. It's like nine, fifteen, seven. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! That's so amazing <laughs> to get that so early. All right. Uh, so we're gonna set up like lists, but first I want to get all the stuff out of here. All right. I don't quite remember. 
remember which one what nest is, but I remember that. Uh, this is Ned. Ned! That's the only reason I remember is because it's Ned. <laughs> Alright. What the hell is up with you? Alright, that was the left leg. Oh. Asshole! Alright, so M R M R something. It's, I think it's like M R C. Damn, what it's M R K. Yeah, nope, it's not M R K. J I H G. No. Thank fuck. Uh, operation report. They zombies, bitch. Oh yeah, the, the the gun flashlight pose is 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 very good. Gunpowder make bullet. I have yet to meet man who cannot swat bullet. Come on, bro. You're allowed in. Don't be shy. The water's fine. There we go. Alright, this is, this is now, West Office is now Legless PD. We're gonna be keeping all of the Legless Zombies in the West Office. Traversing the West Office will be tough, but it shouldn't be too bad. Alright, uh, 106 we're not gonna grab, but 109 we will. 106 just has a film, a film roll in it, uh, which I will not uh, ever use, because <laughs> I don't use the film rolls in this game. God, I'm so glad I remembered the West Office safe. Storage locker. There's keys. Get the keys and you can use the keys on the keys and get the keys. What they mean like keypad keys. Uh, Alright, I don't think I can go this way. Nah, that's locked from the other side. I think I need bolt cutters in order to get in there. <coughs> yes, Silver, I know. And that's one less zombie to worry about. Film roll, uh, I'll show you. You know what, I'm, I may as well go grab that film roll, that way I can show you what it does. Just for the sake of, you know, the video and the stream. So those boards will never be destroyed. So that zombie is permanently locked down. The, the the boards are nice, it's just typically I don't carry them around with me that much unless I have a lot of inventory space, uh, which we don't right now. Alright, so we grab the film roll, we take it back to specifically that safe room only. The only place that you can use the film room is the safe room that we were just in over here. Um, and once we do, we can take it into the back room, the dark room over there, and develop the film, and it'll show us stuff. So this one shows us this, this is the answer to a puzzle later on, uh, but, you know, it's, it's mostly bonus that you don't actually need, um, so I don't typically even bother, I don't need the bonus, I typically have more stuff than I know what to do with in this game. Because I'm, you know, real good. And I also just realized that I forgot to save earlier. <laughs> no, give me the book. It's uh, herbs. Some of them heal. So the green herbs heal you, and the red herbs will do a full heal, just like in the previous game. Uh, the blue herbs... Uh, okay, well, first off, a red herb combined with a green herb isn't just a full heal. It is also a... Uh, it will protect you from incoming damage for a period of time. Uh, so if you get hit by a zombie, you'll take, like... A third of the damage. Oh, that was stupid of me. I should have known I couldn't make that. It's fine. No. There we go. That guy's leg is destroyed. Uh, yes, exactly. So most of the film roll will show you like a location, and there will be like a hidden loot. And that's it. Uh, all right. 
and we'll bring a first aid spray since I took a hit. If I take another hit, I can just pop the first aid. I don't, I don't mind using it. She, she, she will get up, but not yet. Hmm? I'm trying to do something about that. Is this uh DCM? Yes. Nah, That's DCM must be later. Uh, D E D? No. Dead. Dem. Del. Dem. I'll try all the. I I don't know. I could just be completely mis. This isn't because this isn't Cap. Cap is a different one, I think. No, this is this is Cap. <laughs> oh. I I was mixing it up for a later one. All right. Flame rounds literally useless right now, but it's fine. One of these has a zombie in it, I think. No, that's the other side, because this just has nothing. Alright. Alright. I'm so used to having to do these. <laughs> you know, like, you get sick of them after a while, but, like, I don't care. Some people actually, like, hate them, and I'm not that opposed to them. Like, they're fine. <laughs> they're a little they're a little tough on your first run-through, but eventually you, you, you remember. You, you get the memory to actually be able to do anything in your life. Alright, I believe two is much more important. Alright, so, what is it? It's two o. Oh, uh, 208. Whereas if we did 103, that would have gotten us a knife, actually, which is, uh, it, it's arguable. Sorry. The real prize is 203. That's all that there really is to it. Yeah, you can't press the button without a key, it's impossible. Don't tell that to anyone who uses any any type of keyboard, like mine, you know? A mechanical one. Just, just don't ask us questions and we won't answer. We want answers! Yeah, that's annoying. Uh. Alright, just go around. I hope now you can see the use of uh, making a zombie legless. This is DCM. Submachine gun ammo is completely useless I for knew a it while. Would be, but a part of me was like, man, if it wasn't DCM, that would have been funny. Why would that have been funny? I don't know. It just what was that? Uh, the small button in the center of what? Presumably the the keypad. Oh yeah, no, you could, but don't. That's against the rules. You have to you have to have a key to push them. And uh, can you shoot their arms? The zombies' arms off? I presume. I don't know. I've never tried. I I'm I'm a leg boy. I mean, I don't know if shooting the arms off would really do much. They can uh, still bite you. Yeah, but they wouldn't be able to. Maybe they can't attack you from as far away. Maybe. Clear. It's Marvin. How fast can you get back here? Why was that? I've got something to show you. It's important. All right, I'm on my way. Okay, so you'll see that there's that there. If we t were to go this direction, the floor will break out from underneath us and drop us down. We're gonna save that for later as an emergency escape route. You can only do it once, so you know we want to save it. <laughs> And this is a very annoying location, so... Oh, no. I want to get rid of these guys. Anyway. This place sucks, because uh, all, all of these bodies will eventually become a zombie. So the less that I have to worry about, the better. Okay. 
Alright, I don't think these guys will stand up yet, but they will, eventually. Alright, uh, I don't remember, so I'm gonna actually have to check. There we go. The unicorn is... Fish, scorpion, pot. Uh, I would assume you can shoot the rums off, though. You know what? Honestly. Yeah, there you go. You can shoot the rums off. I don't know what it does, but you can do it. Oh, I missed a knife. There we go. Alright, so now I've got a full of my, my guess is just that it makes it so they can't grapple you from as far away. Yeah, I didn't think so. Which is useful. Do all cops have their children write important notes? Um, the men. The men do, at least. Oh, I completely forgot to get the fucking lion statue. <laughs> Uh, the lion is lion, stick, bird. <sighs> We're gonna get dumped into a cutscene. There you are. Come here. What is it? Take a look. Oh my god, he made it! You know him? Yeah, it's Leon. Uh, Kennedy, I think? Oh, uh, the rookie. Thought he looked familiar. You can make it to that courtyard. The second floor, east side. Okay. Thanks, Marvin. I'm on it. Alright, we'll put that away. Right. Yeah, but we're not out of here yet. Uh, don't need that, don't need that. Uh, actually, I think I will get an opportunity to use that. Don't need that. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that. very used to playing this game. <laughs> While we're here, uh, we're gonna use up all the spade key uh, doors. We're gonna unlock them all. That way I'm allowed to discard it. <laughs> Alright, this is a spade key. This should be the last, uh... Oh yeah, I've cleared out the main hall. Good, good, good. This should be the last, uh, spade key. Right through here. Right through? There we go. This is it. Then I can discard it. I don't remember what this says. Guide pamphlet? Welcome to Raccoon City. There's stuff here. It turns a museum into a police station. Alright, that's nice. That's not something I care about. It was a pretty key, but now it's useless, so just throw it in the trash. Nobody else gets to use it but me. Speaking of pretty this. Uh, by the way, we only need that, so throw away the really intricately made staff. Nobody cares about the staff. Alright. 
So I'm not gonna need the red gem for a good while. Uh, I don't think at least. No, I'm not gonna need it for a decent amount of time, so I'm going to put it in the box for now. Plus, I'm gonna go grab the grenade launcher. Yeah, we're gonna be throwing away a lot of priceless shit. <laughs> That's just part of being in a police station. Or sorry, in a museum. Alright. We'll save. No, no, no real reason not to. This game doesn't really give you auto saves. Alright, here's our first trip through Legless. I think one of the guys is back in the office, which is very convenient. Oh yeah, absolutely, me too. I bet there is, though. I'd be surprised if there wasn't. Resident Evil fans make a bunch of cool shit. Because we don't get it from... <laughs> we don't get it from Capcom. Come on, equip. Uh... Cut that to one, that to two. For some reason, the pistol's default shortcut is uh, two and not one. It's 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 painful. Is that guy like dead? He shouldn't be. I don't remember shooting him. Oh, you have to go this way. Right. Actually, wait, no. I that's right. I remember where. That's how I keep things. Because the ammo gets used up the fastest. Well, sub weapons get used up the fastest, then there's ammo. And then all the other loot goes at the top. Uh, I got everything that's over there for now. No, no loot here, uh, other than what was formerly a helicopter. Uh, no. We're not going to be getting into the tyrant for a little while. Uh, once we're on the Leon. other side of the helicopter, the tyrant like this. will appear. Are you alright? Police chopper just came out of nowhere. Yeah, I'm fine. I take it you don't have the key. No, I don't. It's good to see your face, though. How are you holding up? I am hanging in there. Hell of a night, huh? <laughs> yeah. Find your brother? I did actually. He's. <laughs> Just when you think it can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to safety. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please, just go. <laughs> We're gonna make it. Both of us. Alright. Hey Marvin. This is bad. I've got zombies everywhere. Marvin? Marvin, are you there? Marvin? I think you're gonna be kidding me. More prudent information. Alright, so I get to unlock that. I get to unlock this. Uh, while I'm in here, uh, what are some of the more difficult things to do? Okay, well, first off, block this off. That's convenient. I always forget this flashbang. I always forget this herb as well. There's ammo. If you do this, you're allowed to enter through here, and I'm pretty sure if I go through here... No, there's not. Okay, good. So, typically I don't bring boards with me in order to block that guy out, so I'm very glad that I did. I'm pretty sure my recoil was making it so I was shooting the other leg, and it was completely unintentional. 
Uh, I believe another zombie will eventually come through here, and if it doesn't, I really don't care about wasting boards. Oh yeah, that guy's a zombie now. Don't worry about it. <laughs> he, he's, he's, he's what we in the business call a non-issue. I don't think that guy ever gets up. Oh, I walked into that. I'm stupid. <laughs> no stomps in this one, unfortunately. Um, I'm going to play it safe and use the first aid spray now. I'm pretty sure I didn't need to. Uh, like I said, if you take damage from a crawling zombie, it deals less damage than a standing one. So that didn't even get me down to danger, but I'm not risking that. But like, this, this game is full of shit that'll kill you real quick. He's not dead, but I got I get the knife back anyway. There we go. There we go. Okay, I gotta hurry. All right. Uh, I yes, I remember what I have to do next. So what they uh, won't tell you is that you actually need to go this direction again. Uh, I don't quite recall what for. I don't even know if I'm supposed to do it yet. I don't care. I'm doing it anyway. Uh, I, eh, fuck it, I'll bring flame rounds just uh, in case. Uh, no herbs, alright. Uh, hi. Yo, close the door. Oh, yeah, yeah. You never do. And my mom never do does. I'm the only person who closes the door. It's because I'm so used to my door. I'm not going to be able to stop him from getting in. Nope. Alright. Um, yet again, we're destroying that level. Melvin! His, yeah, his Marvin. name is Marvin. His name is Marvin. Alright, and we're destroying you as well. Like I said, the last thing I want to do is worry about uh, these zombies when there's a liquor in here. There we go. There's one more leg taken out. And like I said, if this is a waste of ammo, I don't give a shit. It is. A at this point, it is a waste of ammo because I don't think you ever come back this far. Oh no! Oh no. Oh no. What? Said, yeah. Uh, whatever. Let's go past for now, and she won't be able to. Alright, uh, I don't care about the knife. I'll, I'll leave it behind. Alright. There we go. Now we can use the bolt cutters here. I did shoot an arm earlier. You just didn't see it. That's all for them. So I, I'm starting to think I might be uh, totally wrong. Yeah, I'm totally wrong. <laughs> About. I don't think I ever have to come back here. Uh, not as Claire. I was totally right. I have to come back here as Claire. Damn. I knew. But also, I'm never gonna have to take that path again because I just did that. So if you just take that path now, you don't have to deal with the liquor later. <laughs> yeah, if, yeah, you you just missed it, but it's fine. Uh, put that away. Uh, take out the other flashbang. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. I completely forgot to check these as well. Saving over that. Alright. Um, what do I want to do first? There's a few things I could do. Uh, ah, yeah. There we go. I'll do this first. 
fuck me. Why did that actually scare me? I thought the f it's because I thought the zombie was on the other side. I'm just an idiot. I thought it was over in this direction. Uh, no, there's no loot there. What makes that especially stupid is that horror doesn't get me. All right, so here's a here's a moment that everybody fucks up. See that guy? That's a liquor. We got a note about them earlier. Uh. It was one of these. I don't remember. I think it might have been... Uh... I don't know. We gotta know. Everyone fucks this up. You just walk past them. They can't, they can't see you. Just don't go fast, forehead. Alright, put that there. I believe we need the battery for this. Yes, we do. That just tells us one of the safe combinations that I already did. It's only a surprise if I didn't know about it beforehand, which I did. Alright, there's a first aid spray in this. I, I'm, I'm just going to assume that's Rebecca's bag. Um, and since I... I will not grab that yet. Uh, no, I don't. I don't get the stars. Stars badge yet. See, I can take this. I'm going back to the main room now. Everybody, say it with me. Back to the main hall. Woo! Yeah, see that guy? Don't even worry about it. Just walk past him. It's fine. <laughs> They're stupid. I'm going to drop shit off. That's where I'm going. <laughs> uh, put that away, that away. Pull out a green herb, combine it, put that away, put that there. Uh, yeah, we're good. Yeah, I'll, I'll just save May as well. Uh, yeah, you can. You may be able to see their brain, but that's what makes it so small. Making it, like, exposing the brain to the outside air absorbs all of the smart juice. So they're real stupid. <laughs> yeah, alright. Um, speaking of stupid... No, I know I'm going. I have to go through Legolas. Ah, a new challenger has arrived. Son of a bitch! Uh-oh. Is that shit common from the Binding of Isaac? Probably. I thought I heard a- Hey! Yeah. Alright. I remember what we did. We have to go all the way upstairs. Okay, so... Uh, I haven't heard from, uh... Hmm? I haven't heard from Mom in a while. Is he, is he doing okay? He's sleeping right now. He's not gonna die until we- f After we fight the G. For the first time. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, so here's another uh, tip that I don't think many people actually know. So what we're going to do is we're going to be planting a bomb uh, on... <laughs> we're going to be bombing the police station. Don't send that to the FBI, they'll take it out of context. We're bombing the police station. If we put the bomb there, that cabinet is going to fall down and we're going to have to lift it up. But if you are under it when the bomb explodes... It won't fall. <laughs> and trust me, you don't want it to fall. Alright, we're gonna leave through this way. And then we're gonna go back in. And now that's never gonna fall. And we don't really need to worry about the liquors either. Because they're not allowed to go through doors, so I'm pretty sure their pathfinding like got a little goopy when I left the room. What's the code for this one? It's... 
Lady Bow Snake. That's Lady. That's Bow. That's Snake. <coughs> yeah, no. Once the liquors arrive in here, you really do not want that cabinet to fall because you're going to have difficulties uh, opening it. Alright, we run. So, the moment you start running, they immediately get a beat on your location, but if you get through a door, they literally can't get to you. They, they cannot go through doors like zombies can. Because I know what we're doing next, I'm going to be smart and bring ammo. <laughs> and honestly, I might make some ammo as well. I typically don't like making pistol ammo, but I'm getting low because I've been shooting a lot more legs than I needed to. Uh, I'm hoping that I'll kind of slow down a bit now that I, uh, I know what I'm doing. I'm getting back into the gist of playing the game again. Uh... Shooting all the legs down that way was a pretty big waste of ammo, <laughs> but so be it, so be it, we move on. Looks like it leads underground. Good. Get out of this hellhole. Hey Marvin! What? I think I found the way out. Marvin, come on. Let's get you out of here. Let's go. Are you okay? Oh, no. I... Just go. Save yourself. Come on. It's bad. We gotta get you to hospital Please, now. Claire. We both know how this is going to end. Get out of the city. We can't just leave you here. Claire, please, go. Do this for me. Okay. Hey, Marvin. Thank you. Uh, I'm on a first name basis with the Lickers. I know them in their time off. When they clock off the shift to the RE2 game, uh, they're, they're actually pretty chill. They go by Licker. It's, it's actually their given name. They're all played by the same guy. They're just really fast. He's just a really fast guy. That's why he can appear in so many places at once. Uh, is that... Ah... Uh... That might be the Arclay Manor. That also might be the Spencer Estate, though. I don't remember. Uh, for for reference, the Arclay Manor is the one that we uh, just went through in RE1. That's the Arclay Manor. No, don't save over Leon Hardcore 17. <laughs> Alright. Um, do I have everything I need? Uh, yeah, we're fine! We're fine! We're chilling. having fun. That's what matters. Alright, so that's the direction we're supposed to go in. If we go down here, there isn't actually anything for us now, but if you look in here, this is something that we're going to grab later. Uh, I believe that's um, a suppressor for the... I think we get a Mac 10 It might be a Mac 11 I don't quite remember which SMG uh, Claire gets. Uh, I don't think it's useful at all. Hello? Hello? Uh, but you know, we'll, we'll grab it. Uh, Leon gets a much more useful thing there. But so be it. Uh, we're not gonna. We don't get it for a very long time if you're playing Leon, though.
Hello? Uh, hey. It's okay. It won't hurt you, I promise. Uh. Do you need help? Here, can you take my hand? I'm sorry, I can't understand you. You need help. Why? He's right behind you. What? Oh my god. It's my main man? Wait, what did you say, Laura? You're missing the main man! How many times do you see the cutscene with Claire in the main man? We're not gonna say his name. Because it's a spoiler! It's Resident Evil 2, but the one person is watching, and I don't even know if he knows who it is! What do you mean? How is it a- yeah, it literally is, but it's a them problem that we cannot be an asshole about. I cannot hear you from that far. That was a bit. I'm um, just clarif- that was a bit. Okay, so you know it's William Birkin. Alright, sick. Okay, okay, cool. It, it, that's not how it's spelled, but like, you you know. You know the name. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Yeah, it's my main man, Willie B. Uh, oh yeah, and we're just getting shit. Uh... Like, he can go do his own thing. I ain't- I ain't- this ain't about him. <laughs> it's my main man. Or your main man. It's my main man, Willie fucking B. Willie B. Um, did I get- I got everything here. Oh, here's your reminder to drink water. Uh, here's your reminder that I'm doing a boss fight. <laughs> I just wanted to say it before I forgot. Alright, so... You remember the strategies in Resident oh. Evil 1? We're recycling that. Just shoot him. This is not a good place to have gotten caught. It's fine. I have a flashbang. Yes, we do scream casual conversations in different rooms sometimes. Yeah, that's just part of... It's just part of domestic life. Yeah. Do so you know how he has a big glowy eye? Um, you're, you're, you're supposed to shoot that. Oh. He switched. Oh yeah, and William Burton is a fucking pathetic piece of shit. And that's funny. Honestly, G should have been the killer. Like I'm a, I like Nemesis and all. Uh, that was that was a shame. So if you're too close to an explosion, it, it will not deal damage to you, but it will like stun you for a bit. Uh, that's what happened. It doesn't stun him. It did stun me, and so that fucked me over because I got so I got hit. Alright, we're gonna keep. Now, 
It's over. Are you sure? Yeah, I promise. Everything's fine. I just need you to lower that ladder for me. Will you help me find my mom? Your mom is down here? I think so. I hope so. Yeah. Of course. I'll help you. Shadow's this ladder for just falling on its own in Leon's story. This way. Ah, it's only the one gunpowder. Nope, it's not just the one gunpowder. I know everything. It won't move. Pharmaceutical company? Huh? Her mom's always at work. Yeah. I don't get to see her much. Well, hopefully you'll get to see her again soon. Alright. So, where is your dad? He, uh, um, worked with my mom, but he's. gone. Wow. Both of my. Just me and my brother. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't be. It means we've got something in common, and that's a good thing, right? I've forgotten these two are absolutely precious. Yeah. Sure, this is the way. This is how my mom took me last time. Sherry? I've been looking everywhere for you, Sherry. Brave little girl, leave your house in the middle of this mess. On the ground, hands behind your head. You can't be serious. On the ground, now. Sherry? Tie her hands. Why are you doing Shut this? Shut up. Tie her. Okay, then. You tie her up now, or she dies. What's this all about? Child endangerment, for starters. Sherry, come here. What are you gonna do to her? None of your fucking business. You heard her, I swear to God, my brother is stars and I will fuck that. Sherry, get over here. What's your name? What's your fucking name? Claire! Sherry, you come with me now, or say goodbye to Claire. Okay, okay, I'll go. You better be taking me to my mom. Absolutely. Don't listen to him, he's full of shit. Stop hurting her, please! Don't tell me how to do my job. Stop! Let me go! Let me 
<laughs> Obviously, nobody taught you manners. We'll fix that. Oh, yes, we will. Let me go! Let me go! I'll get you, you fucker! Anyway, cops. You know, as we know them to be. Stay safe, Sherry. Hmm, all of a sudden I feel an unyielding rage. The worst part is you don't get to kill him. Must be where that guy came from. It's actually like infuriating that you don't get to kill Irons. Bastard is the police. Police chief? Why the fuck not? Uh do I need yeah, I need to put power on first. And naturally, of course, only the woman is put in, in danger by a man. Uh, Leon gets put in danger by a dog. So, you know. We're still not quite over our differences, but... Where's the mod where you can kill him? Uh, wherever it is, I don't have it, and I wish I did. Alright, we're not close enough to it in order to actually unlock it, but, you know. I hadn't considered that there might be a mob that does that. Nah, there, there, there's no way. He dies in the cutscene. Uh, where's the loot back here? I don't remember. There it is. I'm not used to looking for grenade rounds. I'm used to looking for uh, actual boxes of ammunition. Alright, we need the diamond key. I think we get that next. Okay. Yeah, we gotta go all the way around. That's fine. What? Is there usually a liquor here? Huh. Yes, Rico. Kaboom. There we go. Oh, there's another one. Let me just miss all my shots. There we go. Uh, if you're lucky, sometimes a, a liquor will die with one uh, grenade shot. Uh, I appear to not be lucky that time. Alright, do I go this way? Yes. Alright, so if I recall correctly, this is empty. Yeah. Uh, one of these three, uh, these three all have nothing in them, if I recall correctly. One of them has bugs in it, so I, I'm not comfortable opening it. Uh, I literally don't care if I lose, lose out on loot as a result. Right, can, I think you can grab the grenade from there, and then just put him back in. Because, yes, he will fall. Why wouldn't he? <coughs> and I'd rather he didn't. Speaking of, that guy will get up. Uh, so I've got to prepare for that. Uh, we're also going to have to deal with one zombie, guaranteed. Uh, one of these has a red herb in it. I don't think it's this one. No, that's empty. That's uh, got nothing in it, I believe. Or maybe this is the one with the herb. Uh, no, I think that one has nothing on it. So then, does this one have the herb? That's, I think, got the key I need. No, don't do that. Alright, so it must be one of those three back there. I'm pretty sure it's the second one that has the bugs. No, it's that one. Which means this one is here. Yeah, Morgan, a police station. Because, you know, that's, that's definitely, uh, it's just a, a one-stop shop, you know? Oh, easy. There we go. 
never have to come back in here again, so that's fine. And I already killed the lookers, so I don't think I'm gonna have to worry about them either. That guy's body fucked with me a little bit. It's fine. He's very dead. Okay, yeah, I literally wasn't even looking at the screen. can't go through doors does not mean they cannot hit through doors. Ah, I really want this guy to die. He just does not want to though. This might be death, actually. I might have just killed myself. By all means, that should have been death. Alright, this is where you get the second gun. Which is okay. Uh, for the most part, it's, uh, for the most part, it's better for now. Uh, but later on, once we unlock, um, Magnum Rounds. There we go, finally dead. Alright. So, yeah, that's done. What? No. What? What's that? No, put that there. What the fuck? What? No, hold on. Wait. No, I know what I'm doing. I've played this game before. There we go. Oh yeah, doors will save your goddamn life. Wait, did I even... No, I did, I did do what I needed to do. I got the diamond key. Okay. Uh, if I recall correctly, because I'm playing as Claire, if I go back down... This way, there will be an item box. I'm pretty sure Leon does not get an item box after the first fight with William. He might. I'm. Oh wait, no, he does. He 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 absolutely does. Um, okay, yeah, just give me that green herb. Okay. Um, combine. With gunpowder, yeah, okay. Uh, typically, I don't do this, but honestly, I'm I'm all for doing something weird this time. Come on. Usually, uh, uh, I don't actually make ammo as Claire, other than pistol rounds. But this time, honestly, fuck it, I'm all for making the acid rounds. I don't use the. Uh, I don't use the grenade launcher enough as Claire. Typically I save all of my flame rounds for late game when I need them against the Ivies, uh, which I have not been doing this run and I absolutely need to be. I shouldn't have done that. If I used that while the gun was empty, it would have fully reloaded it. So I just wasted 13 bullets. Uh, it, like, it'll be fine. Uh, the Ivies shouldn't be too much of an issue. I should get like a fuck ton more flame rounds, but you know, a little scary. What the hell am I doing? That's where I'm going this way. There we go. Fine. 
finally. If I recall correctly, thank God I can actually aim now. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Um, the firing range. That's what I'm looking for next. Now where? Now where is that? It's this way. might be it for the diamond key. Nah, it gets like one or two more. Max. That's film. I don't want it. Go through quick. Nah, just take the hit. I'm never gonna come in here again, so it's fine. Are there any other? That's a door that I literally can't open. These are all fine. So I think the only diamond key left is one in the police station. And that would be... Is it the linen room, maybe? No, linen room is a clover key. Club key, I guess I should say. actually get the SMG. It must be soon, right? Considering they're still giving me ammo for it, it must be. No, I don't I don't need I don't need that yet. Right, uh, anything else? No. Nothing. The lemon room? No, the linen room. <laughs> This is the place that I need the electrical parts for, but I may as well grab that. Grab. Thank God. The key card. That. Mark the door. Take this note. And get the hard key. And just like in. Resident Evil 1, if you examine them, it changes their name. So that's all the keys that we're going to be getting is Claire. Claire does not get the club key like Leon does, but Leon does not get the heart key either. Where the fuck is the item box? There it is. Um, yeah, I'll, nah, fuck it. I'll, I'll keep the, uh, the boards on me. How often... Do I need them? Not very, but when I do need them, I'm going to be happy I have them. Like here. That's what my zombies worry about. I remember something that happens here. This game cannot trick me into a false sense of security because I remember things. I missed. Just a code for a safe I already opened. 
So that was literally pointless. I should have just left. Am I- is it literally just- no, I missed some gunpowder, okay. This game will not catch me slipping. Give me the red jewel. No. That's the starts badge. Okay. There we go. I don't have a heal on. I might want to go back and grab one. I've got gunpowder in my inventory. I mean, I'll, I'll just fucking go back. Fuck it. Yeah, we're going to be getting the diamond key before the hard key, so it can go there. not going to be combining that with our herb, our current herb. Alright, here's the heart key room. No. Uh, the gear won't be here because we're playing as player. Bro, I can't tell if this dude's got the strongest leg of all time, or if this pistol just fucking blows. I'm honestly willing to believe either. There's a reason I don't typically use this pistol. The only reason I'm using it now is because it can store so much ammo. But I'm I'm tempted to switch back to the uh, the revolver. Okay. God fucking! I should have just come in here. You know what? Eh, it's fine. It doesn't matter. It's a literal non-issue. Yeah, there's an herb back there, so... I say an herb, there's two. And you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna do what everyone tells you not to do. Which is? Combine two green herbs and consume it. Bro, this pistol sucks. Anyone who tells you that this pistol is worth it is lying. It's also entirely possible Oh, uh, what's wrong with combining two green herbs? It's inefficient. It's very inefficient with your actual costs. If you combine a green herb and a red herb, it's a full heal. If you combine two green herbs, it's not even a full heal. Alright, Kirby, now! Now it is time. Jesus, stay back! So here's what they don't tell you. Just walk past him. He's it's fine. <laughs> I 
It's that easy. Just go past him, forehead. Alright. There we go. I can put that in the item box. As much as a lot of people like to pretend that the Tyrant is really scary in this game, he's not threatening. <laughs> he's really not a threat. The only time he's actually a threat is if you get incredibly, insanely unlucky, uh, as well as in certain scripted situations during Leon's story. That's it. In actual general gameplay, he's a, he's a non-issue. You don't have to worry about him at all. And it's kind of sad, but also I think I prefer it that way. I feel like it'd be kind of annoying if he was constantly after you. Um, while we're here, we need to take care of something. Oh god, no. Marvin. So, I don't actually know if there's an easy way to kill zombies as Claire. Uh, it's, it seems not. But we do it anyway. I'm sorry. There we go. Just, uh, you know, make sure. He deserves to rest. Alright, where am I going? Oh, yeah, that's here now. I'm gonna have to go around, but I remember where I'm supposed to go. If I recall correctly, uh, actually no, I do need to go to the star's office as well. So that's fine. I can do that as well. This guy's gonna get up soon, I think? At some point. I wasn't running. That's annoying. Ah, there it is. Alright, we'll just do that and run fast. I, I don't mind. The grenade launcher rounds aren't that uh, expensive, I guess. At the very least, the acid rounds aren't. It's fine. Finally, we have a new weapon. Yeah, it, it's the it's the Mac 11. They call it the MQ. Don't listen to their lies. As a gun guy, it's, 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 it's a Mac 11. I could also just totally be wrong. Like, it. This does not sound like Chris. It might be based on a Mac 11. It might not, but not actually one. I don't know. I don't really give a shit. It's a Mac 11. It, as a gun guy, I don't care if I offend other gun guys because I think they're funny to it. Did he really spawn over here? That's about the worst thing that could have happened right there. So, so. It's fine. We'll just loop around him here. Actually, he can't come in the star's office. We'll just follow him. Linen room is, I believe, a heart. I believe it's a heart door. But I could be wrong. Yeah. It's a diamond door? Well, that's even fucking better. That's the last one. I'm not shooting his hat. I'm not giving him the speed boost. The last thing I want to do is make him an actual threat. Hey, hon. Yeah? The rumor got stuck in the bathroom. Let it do what it wants. I'm gonna free it. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah, if you shoot his hat off, he gets mad at you and he'll run after you. I don't know why it pisses him off. Because he likes his hat. Tyrants are capable of free thought to an extent. But only to an extent. Oh. God damn. This is why this room is annoying. No problem. Alrighty. It's not a permanent speed boost. It's a it's it only lasts a few seconds, but like I'm not giving it to him. Alright. 
right, next up, I need to go down this way. I believe I can open that one, so I just go through the west office that way. Okay. This is the west office. While I'm here, may as well do that. Have to open 102. That's gunpowder. There you go. Give, give. I now remember what's that direction. <laughs> Alright, we're safe in here. Um, I don't know if I'm going to need it. I have any use for that anymore. Uh, I'll take this out. There's that. He pauses when you're on the keypad. Your time doesn't actually advance while you're doing inputs on the keypad, thankfully. If it did, that would kind of be insane. Wait, I need to get a heal. Yeah, I'll grab a first aid spray. If I get punched in the face again, uh, that's not good for my health. Of course. He, he, he understands, but he has to play by the rules. Alright, we'll just go this way. I say that as if it's like a choice I'm making. It's not. I have to go this way. Alrighty, and that's that on that. Yeah. Get the crank. Examine it, determine that it's a mechanic jack handle. Grab the grenade that is uh, not there. It's. Isn't there a grenade in here? I guess not. Stupid idiot missed. Oh, yeah, there is a grenade! So that guy's dead. Now I have to go back to the library. I need to go this way. Alright. Where's the library? Uh. It's on the second floor. It's that way. It's over the meeting room. We gotta be real fucking quick. He waits his turn. Alright, so you remember what I said about this path? Well, there's a reason that we save it. It's for this. Actually, I need... Nope, didn't work. That guy did not be where he is, so I don't care. Tyrant doesn't have an easy path back here. 
He's gonna hit me. No. Alright, he drops down. That guy's gotta be almost dead at this point. Oh, really? Alright, fuck it. If that guy's lifting, I don't care about the loot. There's, there's ammo behind that bookshelf. We don't actually need it for the puzzle. We need it for the puzzle. This is why I fucking hate this place. I can't aim. I suck. That was very barely actually a hit. He's gonna punch me. He's going to. Mm. Alright, get him over here. Alright. Thank fuck. This place is done. <laughs> come up here again I literally don't remember why do I need to be okay buddy okay chance to get one of the gears which is a bit of a problem uh, due to how uh, absurdly important it is stage of the game. I don't even fucking remember. Alright, there's something in here still, so it's gotta be the crank. Or, the, sorry, the gear. Yeah, there it is. Alright, we get him to come this way. Mm, we get stuck. Uh, we go the wrong way. We do a loop. This is all part of the plan. Just have faith in the plan. We are comforted by the fact that he's behind us, even though we have no affirmation of that fact. Uh, we get grabbed by this guy, so we shoot him in the head. Uh, he can. The Tyrant actually can crush the zombies for you, but he'll only do it if he drops from a very far distance. Uh, so if he lands on top of a zombie, he he will kill it. Uh, it's just that's never going to happen. Did I put this in the wrong one because I'm stupid? <laughs> I put this in the wrong one because I'm stupid. Uh, for the most part, uh, the Tyrant doesn't do anything to zombies. 
but there are some certain uh, situations where he will do something. So if a zombie would, would be body blocking the tyrant, he will not get out of his path. But if I recall correctly, it does not actually injure the zombie, it just pushes them out of his way. Uh, on top of that, uh, as I mentioned, if he tr drops down from a large height, he will land on top of the zombie. I don't know if it necessarily kills them, but it at the least does damage, because earlier this run, it killed a zombie. Uh, which I think is funny. And also, I literally never knew that could even happen. Um, if the tyrant swings and misses, I think that hit will go through a zombie. I don't think it actually does anything. But, I could be entirely wrong. I think I'm right. I'm pretty sure it wouldn't do anything, because I don't see why it would. Uh, so, for, for the most part, you can't utilize the Tyrant against the zombies. But, there are some situations where it happens as rare as they may be. Uh, the ne Nemesis in Resident Evil 3 is a very different story, uh, unfortunately. Uh, he's... Uh, I don't know if it's something that he can do passively, or if it's a cutscene only deal, but uh, Nemesis can upgrade the zombies into NEA zombies, which sucks. Uh, at the very least, that only happens once in a cutscene to introduce you to the Nemesis Alpha Parasite zombies. But I don't know. I straight up don't know. Uh, Nemesis as well doesn't crush zombies if he falls on them, he's much more mobile that than the tyrants works. are. He jumps around a lot, and if he lands on a zombie, it just doesn't do anything, but he will also push them out of his way if need be. That's it. That's the only thing Nemesis will do to zombies. Uh, all in all, I think Nemesis is more fun than the Tyrant, but I don't know which one I prefer. I I like both. Uh, I used to pretty heavily dislike Nemesis, I thought he was pretty lame, uh, but I've kind of started to come around to him, ever since I actually played Resident Evil 3 personally. Uh, most of my dislike for Nemesis came from the fact that he was added to uh, Dead by Daylight as the Resident Evil killer when I thought other picks would have been better. Uh, namely, I thought Jack Baker would have been a more fun pick, uh, the main pursuing guy from Resident Evil 7. Uh, but I was also a, a big advocate for William Birkin, G being added. I thought that would have also been more fun, and I still stand by that fact. I don't think ne Nemesis was particularly the most fun pick for Dead by Daylight, uh, even if he was the most notable pick. Like, if you're gonna pick someone from Dead by Daylight for Dead by Daylight, it's gonna be Nemesis. Nemesis is the easiest pick in the fucking world, because he's one of, if not the most recognizable uh, bioweapon enemy from Resident Evil. But, like, come on. Have some creativity. Jack Baker is so much more fun. Uh, William Birkin so much more fun. It's fine, though. I, I, I accept. Not everything can be fun. Alright. So, I need one more. Yeah. I don't remember where I actually get the second one. Uh, which is a bit of a problem. Because <laughs> I, I straight up have no fucking clue where I'm going at this point. Uh, you know what? I will... Typewriter. Right. It's been such a long time since I actually did a full run as Claire that I do not know where I'm going. Uh, everything, everything... I don't think there's anything left for me here. Uh... I missed a map back there, but I'm not going all the way back for a fucking map, dude. Um, maybe this place? I don't think you can get through this as Claire. I don't think, I'm pretty sure only Leon can get through that. Um, perhaps at this stage of the game, I'm capable of getting another fuse for the Watchman's room. But no. No, because that's uh, past this way. So that's something. No, okay. You only get you get the fuse on this side, and then you can go through here by unlocking it from this side. Uh, the private collection room is where I'm trying to open right now. I straight up do not remember where the second fuse electric piece is for Claire. Uh, I never finished. I'm gonna clear that room out, but it's not gonna be there. But I'll, I, I'll still go do it now. 
Unless it's literally like back. No, if it, if it was back there, this place would be cleared out. Yeah, I'll go check. I have time. Ah, uh, no, this place is still red, which implies that I haven't fully cleared it out. So, yeah, it's just because there's stuff back there that I haven't gotten. There's nothing in here that I can grab. Oh, God, I thought this game would be easy. I totally forgot that you have to actually play the game when you're playing as Claire. I think he's upstairs. Alright, what the hell is down here? I think there might be loot back here that I missed. Yeah. Whatever. Oh god, where the hell am I supposed to go? The fact that there's very few places on the map that are red is also throwing me off. I guess I could go check out the uh, the east office. Not that uh, there's much reason. All that's going to be in the east office is like some bonus item, I think. I can go this way. Alright, you know what? Hold on. Uh, fuck me. I don't think I've ever read this. Third floor east storage room? What the? F I, th th that's literally this room. That's literally this place. This is the third floor east storage room. There's very obviously not th an electrical piece in here. Unless. No, there's. Th they're making shit up! Oh, hey, it's the electrical piece. <laughs> I always knew. Um, that's because you haven't heard Leon. Leon is the one with the bad voice acting. Claire's voice acting is actually pretty damn good. Uh, and most of the other non-major characters uh, are also very good. It's just Leon's voice actor doesn't really do emotions. He always kind of sounds the same. Uh, but yeah, there are a lot of reuse sound effects, but whatever. Like, <laughs> you know, making games is expensive, dude. Yeah, w w once we play uh, Leon's story, you'll you'll understand. It's <laughs> he just always sounds the same. Alright, let me... Because there's an achievement to be had here. Well, that has to go that way. And this has to go this way. Alright. That must have been achievement worthy. Really? Do I have to do it as Leon in order to get the achievement? Oh. 
Hello. Good to see you again, Claire. We've got unfinished business. Where's that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. You sure you're alright? For now. I swear you bastard, if you hurt her. Stupid kid. If you just hadn't dropped that fucking thing, I could let you go. Don't worry, Sherry. It'll be all over soon. There has to be a way out of here. Alright, so I don't have a lot of practice in this segment. Uh, I don't do... Uh, Claire's story very often. Uh, I need a block for that. Uh, all right, the this. But I know what I'm doing at the very least. Yeah, you play a Sherry. Oh God, I. Puzzle boy. Alright, well, that sort of fits. Uh, Alright, we'll try this way. No, that's clearly not going to work. That's also very clearly not going to work. So close. I hate puzzles so much. I fucking hate puzzles. I'm so bad. Alright. Oh. 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 ones here. I always knew I was right. I knew I could do this. I'll hear nothing. Door. 
as I said, I'm not very practiced with this part of this doing this shit. <laughs> Beat the door out of here. <gasps> oh, no, it's him. Sherry, I told you to stay put. You need to learn to listen. Leave me alone. Just please. Time to teach some manners. Uh. Ah! Oh! You little bitch. You're going to pay for this. Oh, you little shit. You hear I do not remember the hiding spots. <laughs> it's all over now. Doors locked. Yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be. Uh, if he catches you, it's just a game over. You just get locked back in the room. So that's literally just a fuck you spot. He checks that place literally every single time. Alright. Alright, um, in terms of place to die at first, you literally have to hide here. I'd much rather be doing Leon's segment. It's all over now. Doors locked. Not that his segment actually takes place at this point, but you know. Where are you? Show yourself. I know you're in here. The longer it takes me to find you, the worse it's gonna be.
This is your last fucking chance! I just literally do not remember hiding places. No! I don't think this is this is one. Oh fuck! Oh, it burns! Oh, guess it is. Common sense dictates you just lock that door. Hurry, hurry, hurry. What? Don't open. Nice try, Sherry. You are gonna Are you actually dead. joking? No! <laughs> I left click and it didn't read my input. If it actually registered my left click, that would have been fun, but whatever. That was all for the note. It's for 100% note completion. We're getting all of them. We're not. Fuck I will never key. get all the notes. I see you. And finally, that segment is over. <laughs> Good to see you again, Claire. Just all video we games from here on out. Business. What are you talking about? Don't waste my fucking time. Bring me the pendant, or Sherry dies. Pendant? What do you need it for? Do you want the girl to die? Fine. Where are you? The orphanage. The orphanage? Where is that? In the neighborhood. You'll find it. Sherry, all right? For now. I swear, you bastard, if you hurt her. Are you serious? Damn it. All right. Just you wait, asshole. So at this point, I have to remember the way back. Uh, but thankfully, that's easy. <laughs> For Claire, the way back is very easy. I don't think I'll be 
missing out on anything other than the suppressor, uh, which I'm not too caught up on. I don't really care about the suppressor. I don't think I have ever found it useful in the entire time that I played this game. He doesn't have his hat. Is there another box around here? Nah, unfortunate. I forgot to put the stars by the way. That was very stupid and greedy of me. It's fine though. I don't think there's anything to really be scared of out here. issue with being so heavily injured is that you move slower, so this is just a waste of my time. Looks like the only way forward. Absolutely no loot around here, which is not good for my long term survival plan. Are you serious? That's alright. Oh, great, another green herb. <laughs> Don't need a red one. I just straight up kind of have to hope that was the only dog. <laughs> I've got to play this so careful. Just and only because I'm being it's greedy. Be the orphanage. If I stopped being such a greedy asshole, then everything would be totally fine. <laughs> Hang on. 
everyone's sharing. Any anything, anything, anything at all would be nice. It's just a, it's just literally anything. No, a whole lot of nothing. Hello, I have the pendant. Uh. Your fault. What? It took too long. What happened? Oh god. Get, get off me! Oh my god! Jesus Christ! Item box, maybe? Maybe a little bit of an item box? Maybe just anything? Anything whatsoever. Anything at all. Literally, just I'll take a, a, a thing. No? Okay. Seems that we've got a, a whole lot of literally nothing. Sherry! Where are you? Can you shoot his corpse? Uh, Clear. Probably, but Sherry? I need I'll ammo. Right there. I need everything I have. He also got out of here quick. Claire, are you all right? Can you hear me? Claire? Claire, you have to get up. He's going to get us. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up. Wake up. Open your eyes. Hold still. Not infected. Sherry. Where's Sherry? Sherry. Sherry's fine. Do you know Sherry? It's an impressive display of strength. What happened to her? We have to assess the situation. Who are you? I'm Claire. I didn't foresee this. Excuse me. Where is she? Hello? What? Where oh, she? Annette. Tell me, what happened to William? I don't know. Who's, who is that? The creature responsible for this. What? Can you help me find Sherry? Seems to be evolving much faster than expected. Where are you going? Look, I don't have time to play 20 questions. Everything's under control. I need to find Sherry. My daughter is not your concern. <laughs> she's... So she's... Sherry go? Morally neutral at worst and best. about G and there's the magnum rounds but I'm not gonna be able to get the thing for it quite yet all right put all this shit 
shit away. I'm not using it. Uh... Okay. Um, I'm. I'm fucking done with this pistol, so I'm just gonna use up the ammo. The ammo for it as fast as I can. I, I just do not want to keep using this thing. I do not need to either. Cherry? Can you hear me? now that I kind of wish I'd brought any of my explosives, which I did not, but uh, so be it. somewhere yeah so it's it's something I think it's like ZJ like P no uh, QZ something I literally only remember that there's a Z in there. I don't remember any of the other letters, which is annoying. Because we're not going to be able to get back to that for a while. Fuck this thing. All my homies like the SLS 60. We always had respect for the SLS. Uh, no loot back here, it's just the plugs. Alright. So now we've got a section of the game ahead of us. I don't know if I'd call it uh, the worst segment, but it is. It's the worst segment. That doesn't make it bad. Uh. It just means I don't enjoy it as much as the rest. But it's fine. Alright. First and foremost, this safe's code is 2128.0. No, I didn't me memorize that one in case you didn't see. Okay, give me give the herb. There we go. Alright, 
So this is a segment of the game I call... <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> what? <clears throat> Excuse me, fuck. So what's gonna happen a lot is we're just gonna have shit happen. Fuck it. <laughs> That's what this part of the game is. And you know what? Uh, I, I, I'm okay with that. It's, it's fun. But it's gonna take a while. It's, it's gonna take some time to realign. So these guys, fuck it. So here's another thing that the game never tells you, but I will, because I am very helpful. Uh, if you lure these guys over towards you, it's 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 important. It is important. So. One of the other of the many advantages of making crawlers is if you lead uh, any crawler into water, they die immediately. So we're going to wait here for these guys to die because we're going to have to go through this. This is kind of like a central hub point for the sewers. We're going to have to go through this area a lot. And frankly, I don't want to deal with these guys a lot. So I'm not going to. Uh, while they do that, though, I'm going to grab this. Not even, you'll see, they just stop living. Depending on which way we go first is more or less. Fuck it. <laughs> um, I, I don't fucking know, dude. I guess we'll go this way first. Fuck it. I don't know if I have enough shit for it, though. Nah, I, I don't think we will. I don't think you're able to open this as Claire. But I'll check. No, nah, you're not. Alright, so if we say fuck it, we go down that way. But I don't know. I don't feel like it right now. I'm going to have to do this segment twice. And I don't want I don't, to. I, I don't really want to. Granted, I have no fucking idea what I would ever be going in this direction for. Uh, right. Okay. I, I recall something. Okay, so here's another little thing. So, see this guy? We're gonna get him to follow us. Do we have a knife? Yeah, we have a knife. want him to follow us. Couldn't have been more perfect. That's exactly what we want. Okay. So now, this guy should just kind of stay there permanently forever. And be bugged. And we can just not have to deal with him. <laughs> it's weird. It's real weird. But I have tested this so many different times. I've done this so many different times. I'm pretty sure that guy bugs and he'll stay there permanently. And so long as... I don't intentionally get aggro on him, which I won't, uh, I'll never have to worry about him. Which is so nice. 
I don't think you're... Because I don't think it's even intended for you to take him back there. I don't think the game, like, considers it an option. So they don't... They, they must not have, like, worried about it. And, like, I don't blame them. You know? Like I said, you can only work so hard on a video game. But I sure as hell will take advantage of it. Alright, I'm just gonna make those. Uh, yeah, I'll keep them on me. Uh, do I really want to keep the high-powered rounds on me at all times? I mean, I guess. I don't use them. They're like, kind of like, do you get anything for killing them? No. E enemies don't drop shit in this game. Uh, there, there are very, very few exceptions to that, and that is basically, uh, if you have a zombie stuck with a knife, they'll drop your knife. Uh, but you don't actually have to kill them for it, you have to incapacitate them. So some zombies will quote unquote die, but then when you go near them again, they'll stay up, uh, they'll get back up. Uh, if you do that to a zombie, uh, you get your knife back. Oh yeah, yeah, you can see he's just back there. Uh, so you get your knife back. But also in the, one of the side modes, I think it's, uh, Ghost Survivors, uh, you can find zombies that have backpacks, and then if you kill them, you get loot, but that's only for that, that, like, bonus game mode, not canon game mode. The only games where enemies drop stuff is Resident Evil 4 and 8. I don't think any other game has enemy drops. Though I could be wrong about that. Uh, 5 or 6 might, but I don't think they do. Actually, wait, I think 5 does. I can't speak for six. Uh, that's a film roll. I don't want it. Uh, yeah, I can't speak for six because I've never played it. But uh, five, I believe, does. Okay. So let's do this real quick. Gunpowder. Uh, we're gonna have to come back here, which is annoying, but uh, I'll do it. Alright, so that leads back to RPD. This will tell me, actually. SZF. Okay, I'll remember that. At the very least, I'll try to. <laughs> uh, no, no videotape. It's on this guy. This is Ghost. No, I, I can't discard anything. I thought I could discard something. I don't think there's anything this way. But, you know, it's worth checking. Oh, clearly there is something this way. Otherwise, this guy wouldn't really be here. I could straight up just be wasting all this ammo, by the way. Oh, that's a grab. No? He didn't even try? There we go. Oh, this guy! Uh, I mean... I'm chill to see another zombie fall into water. 
I assume we're all chill with that. It's a total waste of my time, and I'm literally on a timer, but I don't really care. Alright, is there literally any reason for me to ever come back this direction? Let's see. I guess I can open this. This is just a way back. Right, is there any loot? Yes. Alright. Is that it? Yes. <laughs> what an excellent use of my time. Um, no, 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 They only die if they are missing a leg. Otherwise, they can perfectly breathe through it. They can breathe underwater. It's totally fine. It's the lack of a leg that removes any and all aquatic capabilities. So here's another issue I've got. I totally don't remember what the uh, second room that you open with this is. I know there's a second one. I literally don't know where. So that's a bit of an issue, but, you know. It's fine. I'll find it. Probably. Hmm. If yeah, police budget's bloated enough, they could probably do that. Here, we'll do this. We'll take a a, 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 a break for a minute or two. <sighs> oh, please, stop. SMG bullet I have. Uh, I'm gonna take this out because I actually have a use for it now. Um, <sighs> Alright, I know what I have to do. I know what time it is. <laughs> oh, this guy could grab me. Uh, if you if you approach them from your left or their right, they'll never hit you. They always swipe with their left hand. Why? I don't know. I just know that they do. Alright. We're gonna do this first. Why? Or is this just a complete waste of my time? Alright, it is no loot. Oh yeah, that guy's probably dead. Oh, more? Yeah. 
to spend ammo. Another door? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Absolutely. Do not be fooled. There's always more. It's never over. Okay. Um... Eh, fuck it. You know what? Honestly... Honestly... When the hell, when the hell else? There we go. Let me through, let me through, let me through, let me through. For fuck's sake. Here's what they won't tell you about. So you can do this shit. Oh, oh, sick. That stuff that I just used. Just to use it. Because I have so much of it. Where is it? There it is. Two big weapons. And you wanna know the worst part is eventually I'm gonna get a fucking another. I literally there's a reason that I don't get the suppressor. It's because why would I ever want another big weapon? I wouldn't. And yet they insist. They absolutely insist. I must. I must have two weapons. I take up two inventory slots. Just so that later on, when they give me a third one, my inventory is a fucking nightmare to manage. They absolutely insist. This guy? Yeah, no, yeah. So he, here's the thing that we do. Excuse me. We will do that every single time. Anytime. SMG ammo. Yeah, it's his. It's I'm not gonna disturb him. I support it. I support that being his spot. So long as it makes him happy. Because it sure makes me happy. Uh okay, so what do I not need most of this shit? Uh <laughs> literally all of that I don't need for now. Someone would probably question whether or not, like, that's stupid, and, uh, because I don't know if anyone else ever does this segment the way I do. They would probably call me fucking stupid if they saw the way I did this, but it, it works. It always works. There's, n this has never not worked for me. Alright, so the reason that this segment sucks 
is because you know the, those big guys okay. and those big sewer guys, there's gonna be like three of them. And they suck. They have a lot of HP. Jesus. But, what if you just didn't have to do anything about them? What if you just ran past all of them? It was fine. <laughs> Go past them. All right, it's fine. Oh, now we can. Out. Okay. All right. So he here's here's the strategy. If you pop one of these, because these guys are the poison enemies. Um, so if these guys grab you, fuck you. See that shield at the bottom right? We literally can't be poisoned, so it doesn't matter. Just let it happen. It's fine. Just get over it. That's it. It's that easy, baby. Fuck it. <laughs> Who gives a shit? Just go. Oh, God. I hate this part as well. I fucking hate this part. Should be a blue herb? No? Alright, I guess I'm lying to everyone and myself. Yeah. No, that's not why Jill vomited. It's because she fucking killed something by by slamming her foot down and destroying its head. Anyway, big weapon time. Big weapon two. Um, I don't remember like the easy way of doing this puzzle. Oh, there it is. It's the blue herb. The blue. Herb. Okay, so that's a queen piece. God, help, help me, I'm lost. We do be running a little low on fuck it juice, but that's why I brought so much. <laughs> yeah, the chest pieces are like the spark plugs. Or not spark plugs, I think they're... They're just plugs. Fuck, yeah, sure, they're spark plugs. We'll just say that for the fun of it. I'm not a, I'm not a me mechanic, nor should I ever be. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. understand now why this is the fuck it sound. Because just don't care. You have a million herbs saved up, just use them. Let 
me through? So that concludes the fuck it segment of this game. Now we go back to the... I missed. <laughs> I should have just taken that hit. I literally have shield from a red herb. <laughs> That was such a waste of my knife and my ammo. But I fucking hate this weapon, so I don't really mind wasting it. Yeah, it's an electricity gun. It sucks. <laughs> and, oh god, I literally just don't have invent the inventory space for all this shit. How do they expect me? How do they expect me to keep all of this shit at once? Alright. Remind me of the solution. The Rook and Knight are on the same wall, and the Bishop and Queen aren't next to each other. The Queen and Rook are opposite each other, too. Alright. Where's the Knight? There's the Knight. Alright. The Rook and Knight are on the same wall. The bishop and queen aren't next to each other. Yeah. Oh god, I have to remember. God, I fucking banked the rook. now we save our fucking game on my way after I grab my ammo nah, I'll keep that all there okay uh, I've only got normal gunpowder as well so fuck it <laughs> From this point of the game onward, there's not going to be any more enemies that inflict poison, as far as I'm aware. Oh, yeah, I have to do this first. Is there a red herb? Yes. Alright, time for me to show off how good I am at video games. another fuck it segment or we're just gonna kind of run around in circles that way he doesn't hit us
Oh, I didn't think you'd be able to hit that, but it's fine. They give you free healing just for this. Should have known you wouldn't die. This fight is always a little awkward. <laughs> uh, do you do you recall this one, Kirby? At all? I think that was a little unfair. I probably should have brought healing, but. Yeah. There we go. Uh, just put it there, I guess. That was a bit. These are all a bit close, but. Ah, uh, yes, I forgot. Spacebar is not going to do anything for me in this game. a bit... Oh, come the fuck on. Oh, let me do this. Let me, let me fucking hit the mandatory button. This... Uh, I literally didn't even have the chance to move. See, so, yeah, I don't like this fight at all. At all. It's a lot of hits that you don't feel like you should take. <laughs> the platform's like a little too small to be fun. The the container takes a little bit too much time to turn all the way back around for it to feel fun either as well. I I think this is one of the weakest parts of the game. Like bar none. It's, it's a real shame that this part of the- that this G fight is such a drag. I think G, for the most part, only has good appearances in this game, except this one. It's just such an... Un I don't know. It's not even necessarily unintuitive, it's just not fun. It, it doesn't work how you want it to. Yeah, you can get hit by it too. And you can both get hit by it at the same time as well. There's different cutscenes for all three. So if you get hit by it, if you both get hit by it, and if only you get hit by it. I'm so sorry, Sherry. This is taking forever. Sherry? Claire? Sherry, are you alright? What are you doing? I'm here to help. Sherry's been implanted. She can't be saved. Are you fucking kidding me? You're her mother. Get in here! You don't understand. William is still out there, and if I don't stop him, 
This conversation is over. Wait. Wait. I, I can treat her. In my lab. It's not far away. Mommy? There's not enough time. Millions of lives are at stake. Sherry, mommy loves you, sweetie. Goodbye. Are you fucking kidding me? Sherry, don't worry. I will get you whatever you need, okay? Oh, why are you doing this? Because I care. Thank you, Claire. Sherry, you're going to be fine. We're almost there, Sherry. We're almost there. Oh, good. The cable car. Sherry, okay? You're gonna be just fine. Okay. Better check everything. There's no turning back. Fuck checking everything. This tram is bound for Ness. Do not exit until the final destination. Just fine without me. Till I came along and got you all sorts of trouble. I have something of yours. I don't want it. Really? Why not? It's so pretty. It's from my mom. For my birthday last year. All I really wanted was for her to be home more. I know it seems like your mom doesn't care, but... Uh, hey, uh, Sherry, come uh, here. Uh, 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 hey, hang in there, okay? Now, arriving at Nets. It's okay. I've got you. Come on. Man, I really do still have Leon B ahead of me, don't I? <laughs> I'm getting you treatment. Just hold on, Sherry. It's okay. I, uh, I didn't think this would take as long as it did, but to be fair, I didn't really know what I was doing with Claire A. I, I couldn't tell you last time I played Claire A's story. Your safety. 
something here antiviral agent that's it that's gotta be it hmm. hey hey sherry i gotta go you stay right here though okay i'll be back soon i promise all right thankfully i actually like this segment of the game quite a bit it's just gonna, you know, man, this game's gonna take a while. <laughs> it's gonna take a while longer. I, I don't know what'll take longer between this and RE1. Honestly, this could take longer than Resident Evil 1. I, I, I didn't expect to get so lost in, uh, in the RPD, but it's fine. It's fine. Actually, I'm gonna need these now. Well, not now, but I'll need them soon, so, eh, whatever. I don't need that. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. So begins the labs. here. Alrighty. Okay. <laughs> I definitely could have seen that coming. Hell is up with you. Alright, well that guy's never gonna be a problem again. Lucky me. Speaking of lucky me, the fucking spark shot can't get any bigger than it already is. Um, right. This should come in handy. I didn't get everything out of there, but I don't care. <laughs> I don't need everything. It's... it's I don't, what could possibly be in there? A knife? I already have like four. How many, how many combat knives do I have? I have three combat... I have four... I have five! I have five combat knives. I don't need them. I don't need any of these things. What do I need to make? Nothing. I don't need to make anything. Just put it away. Cartwright in the east area.
I think my main issue is that I straight up have literally no memory at all of how you're actually supposed to do the, uh, the plant puzzle. I do not remember it at all. Alright. Fuck it. We're combining greens. I have so many. I have so many. I don't need... It's, it's fine. I, I can waste as much as I fucking want to waste. If anyone wants to complain, uh... I don't know, I take cash. I take cash. Yeah, that's everything. Okay. So, I think soon we should be getting the, uh, that's not the right way for now. I think we should be getting the, that is the right way. Then, okay, so then when the hell do we get the weird data the signal transformer thing? Do I just carry over to Leon B? No. Everything we get on Leon B will be brand new. I'm really starting to wish I brought my, uh, Flame rounds. Jesus. I don't think that's a kill. It, it most certainly isn't, just looking at it. Alright. Yeah, we got plant zombies. Ivies. Ivies are scary. The, the, like, I may have said some shit about how I have so many combat knives that I don't need. The reason that they give them to you is because of these fuckers. If you don't have sub-weapons and these guys grab you, it's just, you're dead. Nothing, there's nothing more, nothing less, you just die immediately. Uh, there are very, very few situations that can save you. And by that I mean there's literally one thing that can save you. And I've had it happen to me, I've gotten lucky. Oh no. Uh, basically, if somehow these guys catch on fire while you're being grabbed, they'll let go of you. And I've had that happen to me. And the best part is that it happened to me when I had no sub-weapons. <laughs> so it, that should have been guaranteed ga instant game over for me, and it wasn't. Because I got very, very lucky. Alright, so, like I said, I'm pretty sure that these don't kill. Or this doesn't kill them, but I'm gonna try, just in case it does, because honestly, I never use the fucking spark shot, because I hate it. I fucking hate using this thing. So, like, if these guys get back up, I'm... Yeah, that's what I expected. Alright. Three, one, two, three... That's another thing people don't tend to realize about these, is that they're actually all indicative of numbers. Uh, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 0. It's, it's pretty difficult to tell, but it's true. Uh, a lot of, uh, yeah, another interesting factoid is a lot of people who speak Korean typically, uh, can find a, uh, I, I believe there are Korean characters that look similar to these, or at the very least look the same, uh, at the most look the same. Uh, so I know, for example, when Markiplier played this, because he he speaks Korean and is part Korean, uh, he utilized Korean in order to solve this puzzle, which I find interesting. Uh, I am not that, so I will not be utilizing Korean to beat this puzzle, uh, nor will I ever be capable of doing that, because I do not think I'm capable of learning a second language at this point in my life. After what happened last time I was forced to try and learn a second language, it uh, kind of ruined the, the spark, you know? That interest, the intrigue of learning something else. Uh, that's what a bad teacher will do to you, though. Oh yeah, finally get flame rounds. Alrighty. So that's, what, 
two zero uh six maybe two zero six something yeah this is where this kind of falls off is that some of these shapes literally you just cannot decipher as a number on its own uh yeah when i was in uh high school uh learning uh taking a sp two years of spanish was mandatory uh that's just the law here in uh the curriculum here in america uh, in michigan sorry i'm used to describing things as in america because i've been out of the country for so fucking long but uh no in michigan Oh, that was a bad time to miss. Excuse- oh, there's two. Okay, we're just gonna take a step back real quick. Well, once I deal with these, I'll, I'll start explaining what I was talking about. Because I, uh, I got hit by this guy or I got hit by someone else, and I'd rather get hit by this guy. I didn't mean to do that. I think that was a complete waste, but uh We're gonna do that. God damn the fucking spark shot. I fucking hate it so much. Spanish teacher. Uh, my my first because uh, I had two different Spanish teachers. Uh, my uh, fuck, what year was I in when I took these Spanish classes? I think I was a uh, sophomore and then junior. I think I think maybe it was the other. Maybe I was freshman sophomore. Honestly, I don't know. I think I was. I think it was a. I was a freshman when I took my first year and a sophomore when I took my second. Um, when I was a freshman, my Spanish teacher was like okay. He was like kind of a good teacher he I don't know he was an older guy uh, so he didn't seem very excited or passionate about most things but he he'd been teaching Spanish to like a large large demographic for years so he knew what he was doing it's just he wasn't necessarily very exciting about it um, but I, I learned the basics from him pretty well uh, so then my second year of Spanish in my sophomore year was a very different story. Um, that was uh, horrible. Uh, my teacher, uh, I will not say what her name was for obvious reasons, but she straight up didn't teach the class. There, there is no like more accurate way to describe it because a lot of people think that might be an exaggeration. It's not. She literally didn't teach the class. Uh, most of every day was her giving us an assignment that we didn't know how to read. Uh, and then expecting us to do class on our own. Um, it was not helpful, believe it or not, uh, for someone trying to learn the fucking language. Um, but uh, first and foremost, allow me to say she got fired the year after I took that class. So like, I, 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 my sophomore year ended, the next year came, she was no longer employed by my school. That's, she, got a lot of complaints. Oh, that was stupid of me. Uh, I, I, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, she, she got a lot of complaints. I mean, rightfully so. Again, she just didn't do her job in any way, shape, or form. Um, but 
there were other times because there, the my I don't I don't know what it is, uh, and I'm not saying this is a bad thing at all. It's not. It was very interesting. Um, the uh, most of the schools I went to have had a large demographic of Latino people. Um, and so there was one uh, family. They were uh, they weren't like straight up Cuban, but they were of Cuban descent. Uh, so naturally, uh, most of their family spoke Spanish at home, uh, so they knew fluent Spanish. Uh, and even though these people knew fluent Spanish, they were expected to still take these Spanish classes, which is weird, but like, I get it, I understand. It's part of the curriculum, whatever, even if it's stupid. Um, but they, so they, they spoke fluent Spanish. There was a, there was one dude in my Spanish class. His name was Cisco, and he was from this family. And he recognized, because he, he wasn't a part, particularly good student. And that wasn't because he was like an asshole. He just didn't think high school helped him. And like, whatever, it's not, you know, my decision to make, it's his. Uh, I'm pretty sure he ended up dropping out of his own volition because he already had a stable job and high school was just taking up his time. Um, and I don't know if that was the right decision, but so long as he's still doing okay now, which I hope he is, uh, then it must have been. Um, so he, he recognizes that our teacher literally is not teaching us Spanish in any way, shape, or form. And there, there are some days where he went up in front of the board and actually, like, taught us basic, uh, Spanish phrases. Um, I will say, I actually, I learned very little from him, but that's not, like, through lack of him trying, because he genuinely did try. It's just he wasn't a teacher, and it shouldn't have been put on him to do this. But the only days where I ever actually learned Spanish were the days in freshman year where I had a teacher, in the days where Cisco uh, stood up and like tried to teach us basics of Spanish, um, straight up he did more to teach that class than the actual teacher did. But that that was that's a bit of a story from my uh, sophomore year of high school. I my high school was pretty uneventful. Uh, that's not even. Funny. It, it had some events that happened, but none of them that, like, I don't know, fit well right now. Um, but, uh, I don't know, what else happened during that class? Not much, like, I, I, I say not much happened during that class, that's because literally not much happened. There was no chance for much to even happen. Because, like I said, pretty much all that would happen is we would go, we would go to class, and then we, we wouldn't say anything to our teacher. And that's it. Uh, it was... No. Oh, fuck me. I, I have to actually remember shit. Yes, okay. Hold on. I, uh, this one, and then... This one. Um, I don't know, there, there, there were, there was some shit that happened in that class, but not a lot of it was particularly interesting, it's just, you know, we had, for example, a uh, project, group projects we had to do, oh yeah, it was a very boring class, I fell asleep during it a lot though, because I, I've always been a chronic insomniac, uh, well I say always, ever since, uh, a certain point in my life, which is basically all that I remember of my life, I've been a chronic insomniac, um, and this especially, like, took effect in high school. Uh, my sleep schedule was bad, and I fell asleep during classes a lot. Um, and my teachers didn't even see me as a particularly bad student. I think it was obvious that I just had insomnia. Uh, but, oh Engage. god, okay, hold on, let me, uh, let me have to do this. Alright. Let's see. So that's everything. Um, okay. Uh, how the hell do you do this again? Ugh.
yeah, I, I, I understand that as well. Uh, I had some, uh, some classes that was similar to that as well. Uh, I mean, fuck me, how the, wait, I, I think I remember. Very vaguely, but I think I remember now. I think we do this, then we do this. Let me do this. No, that's, that's wrong. God damn it, fuck me. I'm so bad at puzzles. Oh, shit. Let's just start over. Oh yeah. Alright, so now we're here. What does this get me? Does this get me anything? This gets me nothing. Okay. So we swap around this way. And then we swap around this way. played this game a lot eventually I like memorize like the actual like strategy to it but when I'm just doing it there on my own it's 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 tough right. so that's my last flame round that I've currently got which kind of not good but it's fine Temperature is outside. Acceptable range. Oh yeah, I have to cool it. That's right. <laughs> Oops. I completely forgot you about you have to cool it. Alright, well this one should be dead. Uh, how do you cool it? Oh god, I don't remember. I didn't clear out the testing lab. Um fuck me. I think I have to go this way. I believe I forgot that. <laughs> That's very stupid of me. Um, yeah, let me let me just catch up a bit. Uh, yeah, there, there's there's some fucking shit students. Like a lot of people will say that, like, you know, for the most part, if there's an issue, uh, I need to set this to Murph real quick. If there's an issue in class, it's on the teacher. But I think that's complete fucking bullshit. <laughs> Uh, if you're gonna try to imply that there aren't bad students, then you're totally misunderstanding children. Because <laughs> there are. There are bad students. Um, do I th think it's unfair to call them, like, assholes or something? Yes, because, you know, it depends on the age. Like, if it's some 13-year-old... Bro, I was, like... I was horrible when I was 13. Like, I was... Not someone I want to look... If I met my 13-year-old self and I didn't know it was me, I would actually think that was, like, one of the worst people out there. Unironically. I fucking hate how I was when I was 13. But that's just, like, to an extent. Because, like, not all 13-year-olds were, like, the one that I was. But to an extent, all 13-year-olds can be fucking tough to deal with. Um... Now, when it's, like, an 18-year-old in their senior year, it's like, okay, now you're starting to get to a point where it's like, aren't you a little old for this? But, um, that's besides the point. Um, I, my, my middle school years. Yeah, exactly. Um, again, with exceptions, because, like, the way I was as a 13-year-old was just straight-up asshole. But that's because of Welcome the way I back, was. You have five uh, just messages. give me one sec to focus. I, I don't particularly need to focus Damn. in this segment. Should have packed my parka. Uh, but it'll. Uh, I'll be able to actually talk uh, during this animation. Uh, so yeah, during like 
my 13 year old phase, uh, it, I was essentially just an edgy racist teen. Um, so I would I would argue that I was an asshole because I was. That's all there is to it. Um, but middle school, uh, like when I was actually in it, I was the most like quiet kid. Yeah, I, my my teens were rough. Uh, I'm very glad that I'm no longer the way I was. It, it was it was due in part to a group I was a part of, like a friend group I was a part of, and I hesitate to call them friends because they really weren't friends to me in any way, shape, or form. And to an extent, I think that's what led me to be such a shitty person is just because they were, and I maybe hoped that if I was like them, I'd receive some sort of validation. Uh, I never did. Yeah, but that didn't stop me from, you know, trying to be like them, which, eh, God, what a mistake, but, you know, I, I can't exactly go back in the past and change that. Um, but, again, besides the point, I'm, I, I'm, I'm, I'm so far past that, I think. I'm 20 years old now, dude. I haven't had anything to do with these people since I was, like... 14, maybe? Uh, yeah, something like that, to be honest. It, it's, it's been a very long time, and I, uh, I do not intend to ever, uh, ever go back. Not that I would, like, be accepted there. Yeah, that was the thing, is I... Like, e even my real-life friend group back then was very, very small, so I was part of a... Uh, a, a, a steam group of a group of friends yeah. truth be told it was just an alright group that's all there is to it it was just alright uh, but I was 13 years old and thought I was friends with these people so you know I I got lured in um, so much for the weed infestation. I don't remember like at what point in my life you have how do I describe this I don't know why I like suddenly stopped wanting to be around them I just did you know it, the, I remember I just remember because like after my dad died like suddenly uh, being around them was not fun <laughs> like they they made such edgy jokes and that included suicide jokes and it was like wow I suddenly understand that this is like these are the worst type of people to be around and I wish I wasn't uh, so, luckily I met, uh, someone I'm still friends with to this day, Phil, you met them, uh, they were in chat yesterday. I met Phil, and that got me to a new group of friends who are actually fucking good people. For Christ, um... Thankfully, no, I did, I did actually say slurs, never mind. I was gonna say thankfully I didn't, but I did. I, that'd be, like, a very, very blatant lie if I said I didn't. Um, like I said, I'm not proud of the person I used to be, but that's why I try to refer to that as the person I used to be, not the person I am. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll own up to it. I'm not going to admit that I never said shit that I shouldn't have said, but, uh, what can, I can't change that now. I can only change the person I am now. But yeah, no, it was, it was, it was terrible. Like, I did not enjoy being around them, even when I thought they were my friends. That, like, that's how bad it was. Um, I straight up couldn't tell you why I ever stuck with them. I guess it's because, like, truth be told, they were basically the only friends I had. I had a couple of friends in middle school, and, like, that was it. I had one friend that I, like, one childhood friend, and then, like, two other people I considered friends that I didn't speak to outside of school very often. Like, that was it. So, like, it's very easy to, to have, like, found this group of people, be recognized as a friend for, like, a year. Because I was friends with them for, like, three years. Uh, and it actually felt like friendship for the first couple, like, year and a half, maybe. Anything after that was just hell. It was terrible. Uh, but it, I'll, I'll, I don't know. I don't even know what the hell I'm trying to say at this point. But the fact of the matter is, like, when I was younger, I was a worse person, and I, I'm willing to accept that young people can be bad people. It's just, you know, there, 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 there's a matter of acceptance that, like, first and foremost, 
a young person who is bad is nowhere near as bad as an old person who is bad, and also a young person who is bad can change. I, I have very little faith in, like, older people changing. I, I, I'm a bit, I don't know, jaded in terms of that, just because of all the fucking people I've been around. Um, let me just deal with this real quick. Uh, I need to sort my inventory. I've gotten a bit jaded with older people, because I just, god, <laughs> the fucking people I've seen and been around is enough to, I don't know, it, it, it's, it's, it's bad, but, um, where was I going, right, yeah, I, I, point is, I've had some real fucking terrible classes, um, in terms of, like, the actual class, like, the student, the student body, uh, what, what, what's an example? Uh, when I was in middle school, I, I, I guess would be the best example. Because middle school, my middle school was terrible. It was, um, very, first and foremost, uh, I used to live in the town of K-Pak. And if you Googled it, you would not find much. <laughs> it's, it, I, I'm pretty sure it's not even classified as like a town. Due to its size, it's classified as a village. It's, it's that small. Uh, so not only was it small, but that also meant that it was very poor, which meant that we didn't have a lot. Oh, another videotape. Uh, okay. Oh, what the hell am I even doing? I have been paying very little attention because I've been talking. Uh, let me do this real quick. OSS. Uh, so yeah, k -Pack was a very, very poor town, and uh, we didn't have much in terms of, like, actual staff, uh, ability to teach consistently, you know, the things that you would hope and expect for from a uh, school. Uh, we've got a tape actually here, Let's, we'll watch that. Uh, but that, that also meant that a lot of, like, the students were essentially left to run rampant to do whatever they wanted. Uh, and there were some students who did not, um, I wouldn't refer to them as assholes, but I would refer to them as assholes for 13 year olds. You think I didn't know you were coming? This is my life's work! Well, yeah, we'll just... I'm not handing over anything! We have our orders, Dr. Birkin. I'll ask you one more time. What the fuck were you thinking? Our orders were to bring him in alive. We're in, sir. But we had a snafu. Target resisted. We had to take him out. That's correct, sir. Roger that. Just the samples, then. Let's move. This, uh, this tape never felt particularly right to me. Uh, obviously he survives that, seeing as he's G. But, like... I, I'm fine with him surviving that. I'm not fine with someone checking his fucking pulse and then him surviving. They act like he he died after someone checked his fucking pulse. That's like that's not a mistake that you make. If if someone doesn't have a pulse, they're fucking dead. No ifs, ands, or buts. But whatever. I I, I don't. I'm not gonna judge Resident Evil 2 Remake for that, I'm gonna judge Resident Evil 2 for that. Because I, I would not want to go back and play Resident Evil 2. Uh, I, I cannot fucking stand fixed camera games. That's why I'm literally... I own... I actually own Resident Evil 1 uh, for the PlayStation 1. I own a physical copy of it. Uh, I think I left it back in England, but... Uh, we, uh, we found it at a... 
a CEX, which is, uh, we, we brought it up yesterday, we brought CEX up, uh, we, we found it there, and I was like, oh, that'd be so cool to own, or maybe Maru bought it for me, I think Maru actually bought it for me, I'm thinking of my copy of Silent Hill 2, yeah, I think what, what actually happened is I'm making something up that didn't happen, uh, Maru did buy it from CEX, I know that much, but, uh, what, what happens is he knew that I, because I found a copy of Resident Evil 3 there, Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, let me say. So Resident Evil 3 Nemesis is the PlayStation 1 version of uh, that game. And I was like, oh fuck, that's so tempting, I, I really want to buy that. And the only reason I didn't buy it is because I wasn't too big on Nemesis at the time, so I was like, eh, eh, whatever. I was willing to live without it. I really wish I bought it now, because I, I, I like Nemesis, and I also like Jill, obviously. Uh, but the the next time he went, I think he was like trading in some games, he uh, found Resident Evil 1, and was like, okay, fuck it, this would this would still be cool to own, and he, he bought it, and we have a physical copy. And what I think makes that f uh, especially fun is um, Resident Evil 1 is on a CD. <laughs> Um, which, first and foremost, means that you can theoretically put it in your CD player, but also there's another game, uh, Monster Rancher, that we uh, we emulated Monster Rancher. Uh, the way Monster Rancher works, do you know Monster Rancher? No, you don't Monster Rancher? Alright, so Monster Rancher is, uh, it's what it sounds like. You have to do, like, ranching stuff. You raise a monster. Um. Got it. Let's just finish up the cutscene real quick. Uh, so yeah, you, you, you get a monster, and you have to, like, train it, uh, so that it can participate in, like, tournament fights and shit. And you get money, and then you can tra train better monsters and that shit. Uh, but the way that you get more monsters is you, uh... Your ass again! William! This ends now. I should have killed him while I had the chance. I don't know why, I just couldn't do it. He was your husband. Honestly, we were more married to our work than each other. But what about Sherry? How could you just leave her all alone while Rackham City burned to hell? I couldn't let my daughter grow up in a world with the G virus in it. But that's no excuse. <laughs> <for Thank 
Yeah, I um, alright. I just gotta get all this shit. <laughs> alright, that's gonna be on the other side of the wall. Um, where is everything? Flashbang? I think this guy might straight up just be weak to acid rounds, and I don't think I've ever realized that. <laughs> I don't typically make acid rounds, but I, you know what? Fuck it. I thought they'd be fun. Needle cartridges? Well, I didn't really bring that. Here, I need to change these real quick. Alright. So, Monster Rancher. Uh... Hmm, uh, I didn't think he could hit me. Oh, he didn't. It was just a fire. Uh, so Monster Rancher, as I said, you you get you have to get monsters to train them, and one of the there there are a couple ways you can get monsters. You can uh, buy them first and foremost, but the other more common way is you can put CDs into your PlayStation One, and it'll read the CD and generate a monster based on it. Um, oops, actually, I, I shouldn't be using this. I should be... Jeez. Um, so, for the most part, you're supposed to put in, like, music CDs and stuff like that. Uh, but, you are capable of putting in other PlayStation 1 games, like Resident Evil 1. Uh, so, we... When we were playing Monster Rancher 1, even though we were playing it on an emulator, we could still uh, read the disk drive. So we tried to make a monster from Resident Evil. Uh, it did not let us. Uh, what, I'm pretty sure the issue was what we tried to make was too high level uh, for where we were in the game. So they just, like, they told us no, essentially. And I was annoyed because it, I was interested. But, yeah, so that's the other cool thing about owning a physical copy of Resident Evil 1. Uh, unfortunately, Silent Hill 2 was a PS2 game. Oh, come on. Now is not the time to miss easy fucking shots like that. Uh, so, yeah, we didn't get to make something based on Silent Hill 2, unfortunately. Which I really wanted to, but, oh well. Target has been neutralized. Ending quarantine. Is this the way I'm supposed I to go? Back to Sherry. Yeah, this is the right way. Where's the typewriter? 
Is there not one? No, there's there's a fucking typewriter in here. There's no typewriter. Where's the... Oh, that's not the final boss. I know that seemed very final boss-like, but it wasn't. Sherry's gonna be all right. She'll be weak for a little while, but yes, she's free of the G virus. Did you hear that? about this jacket. I'm so lucky to have you. So we can talk more about that later. We gotta hurry now. Come on. Oh shit, we broke ten hours. Sherry, All right. can you walk faster? Yeah. I don't want to rush you, but... We have to go. Right. Yeah, I've got so much fucking pistol ammo that I could never need. Yeah, ten hours in, not even, not even halfway done with this stream. Uh, please go. Okay. Well. Straight up, we're not even halfway through. <laughs> We've still got another boss to go. We've got more segments. Then we have all of Leon B. Leon B isn't going to take nearly as long as this, plus I won't get lost, because I've done Leon's story so many fucking times in my life. 
God, I still have Leon B ahead of me. Um, Claire? Yeah? Thank you for being so nice to me. For helping me. I'm really glad I met you. I'm really glad I met you too, Sherry. But save your thanks until I get you out of this place. We're close. Hi, hug. Hi, Kobe, I'm back. I fell fuck asleep. Yep. I was gonna lay down and just chill, and then my head hit the pillow, and I, like, collapsed. Yeah, that's fine. The story of this game is fantastic. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, so I didn't hear a lot from the sleep. I heard you talking about Monster Rancher. Yeah, I was talking about how our couple of copy of Resident Evil could be used for Monster Monster Rancher. But it was the monster was too high level, so we'll never yeah, know. Yeah, exactly. We'll never know what it was. But I. I have so much fucking ammo. I'll never need, literally ever. Uh, finally got lost. Yeah, I got lost a, few, a couple times. Cause I just I just completely forgot shit that you're supposed to do in Claire's story. Ah. Uh, I, it, I I I very much do not remember uh, Claire's story nearly as well as I remember Leon's. Ten minutes until destination. I save. I sure hope I saved. Sherry, run! If, if I need to, I can just use, uh, my sub-weapons. Uh, of course. The stupid thing's locked. Hold on! Sherry, where do you- I think I can open it from the other side! Have faith in the plan. Sherry, you hanging in there? Hey, right behind you. Had a girl. Think we're almost out of here. Great. The try. All right. So, what do I know for a fact? I'm not gonna need. Uh, actually, you know what? Maybe I think I will actually need. The nine millimeter parabellum. Uh, I won't need that <laughs> at all because I don't have ammo for it. This I do have ammo for, so I, I I'll use it against my will. Nah, this uses seven six two. All right, whatever. Alright, um, oh yeah, I forgot to pick up the actual thing I have to have. What are you doing? I gotta get this train moving. I need you to stay right here, okay? Okay. I promise I won't move. Good. Be careful. Always. There, don't worry about the fact that they're giving us this big gun. Just don't worry about it, it'll be fine. 
It, it, there's no there's no point. There's no reason behind it in any way, shape, or form. We already fought the final boss. Right. Something. Okay. All right, it's working. Claire. What? Leon? You're down here too? Yeah. But the whole place is coming down. Look, you need to get out. Fast. I know. I found a way out. I think... I think we can all make it. Where are you now? Claire, are you still there? Leon? I'm sorry, you're breaking up. Don't worry about me. Just get out of here. Leon! Leon! And then naturally, there's the fucking Arlene on there. He got too much curves for that. boss like this, they move in a sort of straight line. Either those hits by being aimed at him. It's fine. This fight does not typically take me this long, I feel like. Oh, 
Okay. That's all we got for this game, other than cutscene. Claire! It's okay. I'm here. We're getting out of here. something to eat. <laughs> so what's the first thing you want to do when we get out of here? I want to see where you live. Good. So I take a shower. Yeah. <laughs> really? That bad. Oh yeah. Claire! Leon! It's so good to see you. I told you we'd make it, didn't I? You did. And, uh... Yeah. We'll pause there. For now. Uh, uh, I'm gonna look for something to eat. Uh, so I will be right back. I mean, I need to eat, too. Well, yeah, but you can stay here for a sec.
Silver, what are you doing down there? Alright. Uh, I'm not gonna include this. Just it's it's post it's a post credit scene. It doesn't need to be added to the timer. Oh, I got S rank. Sick. First time I gotten that. All right, what do I unlock? How the fuck did I get S rank? I got so lost. Whatever. Alright, let me see my bonus. My bonuses. So I got... What? I'm pretty sure I got a new model. Didn't I? Lame. Okay, Silver, the door is literally open. Just shove your face into it and it'll open eventually. Come on, Silver. Crack the door open for him. He's old. Old sport? Are you Gatsby? Um, uh, never mind. No, I'm Gatsby. You're, you're Jay Gatsby? I'd rather be that than anything else, so let's let the record show that on this day I'm Jay Gatsby. <laughs> Shoutouts to the, uh, fuck, the AO3 Great Gatsby. Oh my god, the AO3 Gay Gatsby. Gay Gatsby? Gay, the Gay Gatsby. The, the, yes, exactly. <laughs> Hello. Someone, so, so, someone came over and said hi. I don't know who it is, but hello. I don't know. Hi. Whoever it is, hello. It could be Kirby's uh, iPad. I don't know. Kirby and Kirby's iPad? Yeah. <laughs> I Like, if there is a second viewer, I don't want to be like, you are nothing more than an iPad to me. But, no. Like, <laughs> I, I, no one would take it as that. It is. It is yeah, it's, it's possible. Uh, You're right. I understand. Hey, I'm I'm I think once you eat you'll be better. Yeah, I'm 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 hyping myself up. I'm up I'm not gonna sit back down. <laughs> That's the plan, is I'm not gonna sit back down so I can cook, but I got I still gotta hype myself you up. You remember how to cook bacon, yeah? Yeah, you flip it a lot. Yeah. <laughs> you remember that the further into it being cooked it is, the more likely the more quickly it'll cook. So, so the more cooked it is, the faster it'll cook. It says two viewers for me. Is it not two viewers for? Oh, we, oh, oh, I'm li oh yeah, I'm literally not in the stream on my, on uh, my Firefox. Am I being lied to? My my OBS Studio stream element says that it's it's two. But perhaps perhaps it is not. Oh yeah, I literally can't tell. <laughs> Uh, yeah, whatever. If it's not two, it's not two. If it's two, it's two. Yeah. All right. So, you know. yeah, that hmm? wasn't words. It wasn't. I was about to say so. I swear to God, I'm doing great. I'm. F I feel amazing. I dreamt that you were preparing for the Leon run, and you got some special bullets called double water. Double water. Double water rounds. They were like the grenades, but water. <laughs> oh. Big and I, wins. And I was like, damn, bro, you don't, I've never heard of double water. And you're like, yeah, they're real good. And I was like, oh, <laughs> shit. They're real good because they hydrate. Like I am. I'm pretty sure I heard you, like, outside of my sleep. Like, I could hear you in my sleep talking, like, like sucking. Wait, no, never mind. Uh, no, 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 no. Finish no. that sentence. No, no, I don't, think, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. No, finish that sentence. What the fuck did you think you heard? No, I was being. I was a metaphor. It was a metaphorical thing. It was a metaphorical <laughs> thing. The dick sucking was a metaphor, guys. I thought you were, like, sucking the dick of the acid rounds. No, I wasn't. I, I, I was. I, I mentioned at some point that I thought perhaps. Uh, G stage three was weak to acid rounds, but that's it. That's I, I, all I said. I, I, I thought I heard you like, damn, the acid rounds are better than I thought they were. I should use these more often. Like, no, I never actually said I I should use these more often. I simply said I was using them a lot that run compared to what I typically do. Well, I was awake for that though. Well, listen, I don't. 
I didn't ask. Listen, that's all. I, I, I was asleep. No, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna hit enter and off we fucking go, boys. Leon B. around by the way I'm pretty sure Maru is wrong I'm pretty sure that uh Go. don't shoot get down I'm pretty sure that even in Leon a uh, Leon still saves Come Claire on. what the hell is going on I don't know Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Claire, you okay? Yeah, I'm all right. How about you? You can't stay here, it's not safe. I'll be there. All right, do I have to play this? Or do I uh, just get dropped in to where uh, I'm supposed to go? Yeah, I just get dropped in. All right. Claire. No? I hope you made it here. I forgot to take a How long have they been in the fridge for? They haven't been in the fridge at all. The bacon? There's bacon in the fridge. No, the Borg. Oh, the Borg. Oh, uh, you know, just toss them, uh, put them in the microwave for a minute on a five minute. power. Okay. Yeah. On five power, it should be fine. Green herb? Hmm. It appears not. Hey! Claire? Leon! I'll be right there! meeting like this are you all right please chopper it just came out of nowhere yeah I'm fine I take it you don't have the key no I don't it's good to see your face though how are you holding up I am hanging in there all of a night huh yeah you find your brother I did actually he's <laughs> Just when you think you can't get any worse. Leon, you should get going. Don't worry about me. Just get yourself to safety. No, Leon, seriously, they're getting through the fence. Please, just go. We're gonna make it. Both of us. So this part, uh... Oh, what the hell? Oh, uh... Hmm, I didn't quite realize how low my ammo count was. I completely forgot the Matilda fucking sucks. <clears throat> so be it. It's fine. Exactly. Yes, we get the 1911. Sorry, the 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 N nineteen. Uh, 
It's just an M1911. <laughs> um, so the M M1911. Um, so the second run adds another weapon and ammo type compared to the uh, prior run. Uh, we're not going to use that. That feels a little cheaty. Um, uh, b both of the uh, added weapons are kind of memey. What? They don't like the frost at all. Uh, they're not. Put them in. Just put them in for another minute. Not five. Also, what was I gonna? I was gonna say. So, oh yeah, they're way bigger than the bombs, which isn't a problem. Not exactly how I picture. Uh, they all shrink. Shrink? Oh yeah. They do when you cook them, they'll shrink. Okay. But yeah. I'll, I'm, I'm Bread. Holy shit, it's him. It's Brad, let's go. Brad! We all miss the hero. The people's champion. People's champion, Brad Vickers. Right. They're, they're, so anyway, they're, they're kind of meme -y. So he holds the M1911 sideways because it's haha -ha funny. And then uh, Claire's second round, you get like a, a revolver that you uh, fan the hammer of. That was fucking really risky. This is not how I imagined my first day. I right, grab this because if I recall correctly, God. That's so that's unavoidable. There we go. I don't think I can board that one up. God damn it. Oh shit. What the right. Have I passed by the fuse? No, but I passed by some ammo. Um, okay. Uh, I won't take that. More ammo. I I literally just don't have space for any of this. It's 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 whatever. I need to head to the main room. I, I don't think I need to get the fuse. Yeah. Leon, second room. Nope, I do. I need to get the fuse. Okay. Well, <laughs> this has been enlightening. for any of this. So I'm pretty sure normal handgun ammo will be replaced by large caliber handgun ammo for the most part. Uh, normal handgun ammo is either literally you don't get any of it to spawn and have to craft it, or you get very little of it to spawn. Uh, but I'm pretty sure it just straight up doesn't spawn in general. That all right, so that's open by default. <laughs> Scrap of paper. All right. <laughs> Actually, wait. There should be a knife here. I literally don't have space for it. <laughs> I, I kind of already forgot that. Right. So this is a new location. Alrighty. Alright, high grade weapon, get them powder. Oops, I didn't mean to put the ammo away actually. 
And I'll keep the flashbang on me, just in case. Actually, no, I will not, because I need to go back and grab that knife. There's the fuse. Uh, I literally have no use for mag ammo at the moment, nor will I for a while, and the same goes for this! This run should probably only take a few hours. That almost hit me. And by all means, probably should have, considering I didn't listen to my own goddamn advice. I didn't grab the knife. fine because I'm just making trips back and forth. I meant to do that. Where'd uh, what's his name go? The legless guy. Oh, there he is. That's good. Uh, typically you want him to stick around in the hallways as opposed to in that little room. Uh, it's a lot harder to dodge him in that little room than it is in the hallways. There we go. And I'll put that... No, I'll put that away. Pull this out. Take this out. Put that away for now. Put that in for now. Put that away for now, because I literally won't be getting handgun ammo for a while. Uh, I can just put most of the stuff away, because I'm going to the main hall. Which, there should be an item box in the main hall as well. When I say should be, I mean there is. If there's not, then something has gone terribly wrong. Otherwise known as I fucked the game. Oh wait, no, I'm Hello? I'm so wrong. Is <laughs> there is no here? item box here in this fucking in a second run. What the hell was I thinking? I'm a fucking idiot. Something tells me he's not a cop. Alright, I'm just gonna grab all this shit then. Notebook with missing page. We don't have the spade key yet, so I need to go in this direction. Yeah, so I believe there's going to be a liquor in here. What in the? They uh, they spawn liquors on you quick. But, like I said, liquors are easy. Just walk past them. I think at this point I can start running. Just because it won't catch up to me. Oh yeah, you get no help from Marvin in your second run. God! I'm an idiot! I'm fucking stupid. I literally shouldn't have gotten rid of it. This is really important. Yeah? I really need your help. Okay.
issue was that the, the, the electric grill we cook on uh, was smoking and sparking, which is two things that you typically don't want it to be. So yeah, I think it might be time to replace it. <laughs> or something. MRG. There we go. Back up. This one was what, 9, 15, 7? Yeah. Hip pouch, I believe. Yeah, hip pouch, let's go. Uh, that's a grab, but I have to. <laughs> I believe that's everything in here for now. Yep. And let's see. We can get 106 and 109. And we actually have to get 106 this time. Uh, 106 last time was a, uh, a puzzle solution. This time it's not... It's less of a puzzle solution and more of a main story puzzle solution. Uh, I believe it gives us the code to the lion, which we do not have by default. In the in the in the book. All right. Oh, that's very unlucky. Son of a bitch. Jesus. Six shots. It's not. It's the same thing. What's the difference between what?
That's the one with the body in it. I didn't think we'd be getting that quite yet, but I guess we will be. You know what? what what's the difference between what? I, I don't quite recall. The, the context behind that question being asked. It's fine. Just, you know. Uh, I'm not gonna grab that yet. Uh, yes, I am. I have to go back to the main hall. Okay. Unicorn is... Person... Pendulum... Snake... Sorry, not pendulum of a, a scale. Right, uh, there's not much, but, you know. No, I, oh, for fuck's sake. There we go. That's such a waste, but I don't give a shit. There's so much stuff I need. Why did they. I think this one comes back as a zombie. We'll see. Yeah. I don't remember. I'm not gonna keep trying though, because that feels stupid. up all the different uh, places that we can use the spade key for now, uh, and then discard that, and then I'm gonna head back to an item box and clear out my fucking inventory. God, there's so much more shit that you don't need. Uh, here's another difference between a uh, normal run and second run is that zombies spawn in the main hall, like, constantly. Alright, this one's 6 to 11. Alright, compensator for the Matilda. Yeah, Leon's exclusive key is the club key. Uh, I we won't get that until after uh, the first fight against G. Yeah, no, we 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 get it like right before the tyrant uh, first appears. Hey, I'm gonna bacon, like, slot two in that. Yeah, just slap a couple of them. 
going to unfold them or anything, or just slot them in like a half? Uh, yeah. Yes, he's the one that's cut in half. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. So just slot them in. Slot two in. Okay, I'll do that. You put them, you, you tongue this thing on and then put them in. Um, no, you put them in first. And then you turn it on? Yeah. Okay. It doesn't really matter, but you know, okay. that's typically what I do. Uh, what's another thing that I can do? I know what I can do. I can go use the bolt cutters. <clears throat> at, at this point in the game, it's just I have a lot of shit I need to do. Uh, that I, uh,. I have to pick, and I'm not a very decisive person, but uh, at the very least I, I know this is something that I was supposed to do earlier, but didn't because I put the fucking bolt covers away like an idiot, but I can do it now, it's fine. This is the last use that we're going to have for the bolt covers, I believe, so I can discard them. There we go, that's the bomb. That's another bomb, and that's wood. Oh, that's an herb. I'll take the herb. Oh, uh, yeah, this place. No liquors here. Cool, why? Yeah, actually. Put everything away. Got five Matilda shots, and I don't think I'm ever gonna get more ammo for it. <sighs> oh, I'm kind of tired. I woke up at 6:30 a.m., so I guess that makes sense. I've almost been awake for 12 hours. A little, a little under 11. <laughs> Uh, I know something I forgot. That's stupid of me. Uh, why am I bringing this? And fuck it, why am I bringing that? That's It's just a waste of space. Oh, I already used it. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, I'll bring the electronic gadgets. The bomb. I believe we'll be getting the battery once we uh, head to the star's office, which is this way. So yeah, we'll be getting the battery now, so I may as well bring that with me. I don't know where we get the, uh, the security pass. That's that's my, my current issue, I don't know where we get that, and I need that to get the shotgun. I'm hoping it's somewhere around here, but I genuinely have no clue if it's in the star's office or not. It could be, like, right here. It sure isn't, though. State spray? Alright, sick. Jesus Christ! Oh, that's when he appears? That's why there's no liquor there, is because the fucking tyrant appears, but, you know. Maybe this is the security pass, actually. Why would it be, but maybe it is. Nah, it's the film. No. Take that. Uh, take this.
Oh yeah, he 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 comes by a lot earlier in this, uh, in this in in the second run. Oh yeah. Um, fuck me. Where do I need to go? Uh, I need to go to the art room. I also need to go drop some shit off. Not having the central uh, item box there is so fucking annoying. It makes everything so much more inconvenient and not much else. Same with the typewriter not being there. Alright, this is where I get the security pass. scepter immediately actually we're gonna grab the security pass first and then i'm gonna head to the uh i'll, I'll head to the shotgun uh then i'll drop a bunch of shit off well uh on second thought i'll grab it now because i have space <laughs> That is about as bad of timing as it could have been. Actually, that would have been fine if I ran there. There. That's fine. He doesn't like he doesn't like it when you try to run past him, but you, it's fine because that doesn't injure you. Yeah. I'd rather get bitten in the ankle than fucking punched. Uh, I should never have left him standing. Alright. So be it. I should have known better. I do know better. I just did it anyway. Yeah, alright. I've still got food uh, not finished, but, you know... It's for a good reason. That being, uh, our thing literally is broken, and if we use it, it's a fucking fire hazard. Alright, what's the lion statue? Crown Brazier Bird. he have to be here right now? That's, uh, I walked into him. That's fine, that didn't take me down to caution. Crown. 
down. Razier, and where's the bird? There's the bird. So now I've just got two. Uh, I have to get to the star's office. I need to go to the third floor. I got a lot of shit I need to do. I don't have to go to the star's office, but I absolutely do have to. <laughs> I'd be missing out on the Magnum if I didn't go, which, uh, funny, I'm not gonna miss out on the Magnum. I have all this shit to miss out on, I don't think it's that. That probably should have hit me. Do I need to go this way? No. I mean, I should have. That way, the tyrant would have, you know, lost my 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 my, my trail. But smart gamers don't need the tyrant to lose their trail. They understand that they're faster than the tyrant. They're getting ahead of the tyrant, and they realize that there's not a lot of thoughts going on up there. Yo. Meal that I cooked today looks like so. More than that. Oh, geez. Does it look good, though? Yes, it looks good. Okay. Thank you. It's okay, hon. You don't need to worry. It's okay. I know you're newer to cooking. I... I wasted so many... <laughs> Say that again? You wasted so much what? Plates. I wasted so many plates, and I got the bonds out, and then I threw the bag that they were in away, because I was like, I'm going to use these, and now I'm not, and now I don't have anywhere to put the bonds. And then I put the bacon directly onto a plate, and I forgot about the whole put a thing under it, so it it's doesn't It's fine, leak. it's fine. Don't worry about it, huh? I don't know what to do with the buns. The buns? That, I don't know. Ugh. Straight up, they might have to be thrown away, because we don't have any place to put them. But you couldn't have known. Stop, stop, like, beating yourself up over it. Literally, we couldn't have known that the grill was busted in a fire hazard. I just, I just want to man. I know, exactly. But let that be a bit of a lesson. Only take the buns out when the burgers are cooked. Just, you know, typically for other reasons. That being fresher buns. Okay. Should I just, how much more do you think? Like, just um, get me... Four more. Four more? Yeah, just four more slices. I'm going to have to do it in two more. Slices. Yeah, that's fine. Should I re non-stick it? No, I, I, I don't tend to. Uh, the liquor should be here by now. I'll assume that's what that was. Ram Harp Bird. And there's the harp, and there is the bird. Alright, just kill him and get the fuck out. That's really annoying, but I don't mind losing the knife for now. That guy really couldn't have had much worse timing. Let me through? I don't know if this is considered a safe room in terms of whether or not the tyrant's allowed to come in here. 
I can only imagine it is. That would be kind of rude if it wasn't. Stupid, I should have done that. And brought... What? They got pieces of free song in there from the old one. Like the great, like the charred stuff. That's fine. Okay. It's fine. It's just bacon. I should have brought something to heal with. Okay, that's fine. You could have asked me to close it. Why didn't I take the fuck? I forgot to take the fucking stars badge out of the goddamn computer. So now I have to do the goddamn walk of shame all the way back. avoid that. <laughs> I'll just dodge that. There we go. That's never happening again. Currently, I have a grenade equipped. Just to prepare for William. Shame over. There we go. Like, oop. Oh, a second grenade. I didn't know that was there. I was here for this. This is what's in here for Leon. It makes the Magnum even fucking stronger. <laughs> you know, that thing that the Magnum definitely needed to be. What the it feels like just a few minutes ago I was already here. Doing GS player does not feel like it was that long ago. So I guess that's a good sign.
this thing. Back to my strats, otherwise known as just do your own thing, baby. Don't worry about it. I was gonna let him grab me so I could throw a grenade at him and do deal a shit ton of damage, but <laughs> I guess he had other plans. And who am I to say anything? I guess. than last time. That's the upside of having three frag grenades, though. And like magic, the ladder of sudden descends. Somebody's watching. Oh, my knife! They gave it back! I didn't know that. I was fully prepared to lose it forever. I was intending to lose it forever, as a matter of fact. Yo. You need a break. Okay. I have to have four of them on the floor. It's okay. Just throw it away. It's fine. You're being too hard on yourself, Mari. I'm just sad. You're still being too hard on yourself. At the very least, you can have these. Thank you. Let me think. Um, yeah, the next segment sucks. For for Claire, it's not that bad. It's only uh, it's just a bunch of uh, a couple of liquors. But for Leon, it's a lot of dogs, and I much prefer liquors to dogs. Liquors are so much easier to deal with to an extent, but especially as Claire.
Damn. Need a key card. You gotta be kidding me. Get off of me! Sharp. Lower it. FBI. Sorry. Thank you. For your help. Surprised you made it this far. FBI, huh? What's going on here? Sorry, that information's classified. Where are you going? Do yourself a favor. Stop asking questions and get the hell out of here. Hey! I'm not done talking to you! Alright, where to first? Um... This one. this. I don't even remember. Oh yeah, this is the car key. Which is basically just a waste of my fucking time. All it gets is the Matilda free round burst stock, which I literally don't pick up. I hate it. I hate the concept of turning the Matilda into a three round burst. As a matter of fact, I just hate three round burst anything. Like, at least Claire's pistol seems better when you pick it up, because it's got so much ammo, and it's got a laser sight, and it's not better, but at least you have to figure that out on your own. I can't see. I can never see three-round burst being better than just single shot. Okay. I don't think killing them now does anything. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure um, more will just spawn if even if you kill these ones. Right, nothing that way. So this one has the red herb. Flashbang. We'll put him away. Just like usual. Um, other than that, this is just a body. If I, no? I guess it's this one? Yeah, this one is just a body, if I recall correctly. This one gives us a key. I do not recall which one this is. Uh, is there not another one with loot in here? I don't think there is. So we'll just pull this out. I'm already forgetting like, important shit. Eventually, once dogs get loose, they'll start spawning in here. 
some of them will spawn in this in this place, which sucks. It's it's terrible, and I hate it. But it's fine because uh, we won't have to worry about that. Because I can just shoot them. to the boss fight. Uh, I don't quite intend to fight G again. last ones alive? No, no, there's a few of us. Huh. That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's of course Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I did him the same thing to him, I guess. I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage. Believe me. Sorry. I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in this station. So either we play nice and help each other out. <laughs> Shit. It's coming. What? What's coming? Come on. Come on, don't be an asshole. Okay, you need this. Just get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> Oh my god. Who is that? It's just me. So we can put that thing away. I, I don't even know what happened. It just happened so quick. I told you to get out of here. You wouldn't want to end up like Ben, would you? You knew him? He was an informant. Had information of use to my investigation. So what he said was true? Hey, you can't keep walking away from me. I don't even know your name. I'm Leon Kennedy. Find a way out. Leon, before it's too late, then we'll talk. Most random guys have better Kida. voice acting than Leon. <laughs> what? Well, I guess the deal's on. It's true. <laughs> All right. I literally have no memory of that tool. Oh no, I do. But how the fuck am I supposed to get back? Uh, oh, right, yeah, okay, wait, no, wait, yes, yes, I remember. I, I'm very clearly someone who remembers, judging by the fact that I just went the wrong fucking direction. Other dogs? Just in case. This time there will be dogs in here, though. 
So I'll want to keep this out. I think one shotgun blast can kill a dog. Oh wait, are they not out? Do they only come out after I turn the generator on? That's surprising. Gotta go to the clock tower, but yeah. I think I always miss that herb every single time I play this game. different depending on who you are not based on if it's an A or a B uh, I, I even okay I got hit once stunned from the hit and then hit again I fucked up. It was upsetting because I was like, damn, bro, I put my heart and soul into that bacon. I understand completely. I was like, oh, but I tried really hard and now it's gone. It's okay. It happens. Where are we? We're in the parking lot. Mm -hmm. I just didn't know where we I have to get the electronic parts, so I have to get the one from the clock tower. Still got a lot of ammo since I only ever craft shotgun shells as Leon. Bro. They're just spawning more. They're literally just spawning more on me. Christ fucking bug. This is so much fucking easier as Claire. You literally have to deal with two liquors and nothing else. That's it. by the psychic damage of chief irons. Nah, not really. <laughs> Cuz you still have the damage, the psychic damage of Leon's voice acting. <laughs> you know what? Hey, listen, voice acting, you can only it's not easy, but it's not that it's not this hard. <laughs> it's also not exclusively on the voice actor, it's also on the director. Yeah, but that too. Leon's DVD voice actor did a good job. And all he had to do was scream. Uh, and go, owie. Maru, Leon's voice actor makes his, like, his pain noise sound like he's fucking moaning. Yeah, what of it? That, I don't think that's necessarily what, you know, 
they wanted. It still sounds like pain. It doesn't. I think I, I hear both. Another one. Uh, we'll, we'll see about killing this one. Uh, nah, I don't need to kill her. I don't want to use the shotgun shell. Uh, actually, I do. Because I have so little handgun ammo. Yeah, if we want to talk good voice acting in Dead by Daylight, uh, like the Resident Evil chapter, look no, Claire. Yeah, like no, look no further than Claire. Alright. So, I need to go to the... I remember. I remember the way. Yeah, I got everything I need. I think this might be a guaranteed hit. Yeah. I think this is the last use for this crank, so I discard it now. Yes. Then I have a board that I can use by going downstairs. But I'm not going to be able to do much else downstairs at the moment because I don't have the club key. Still hungry. Yeah, I'm gonna get you more. Alright. Okay, give me the ammo. Uh, so I think this place is locked. No? Not locked. Is this place locked? No, okay, I, I didn't think so. God, I fucking hate that they don't have an item box in the main room. It's such an inconvenient waste of time and nothing else. stage in the game. They honestly would have stupid waste. Hmm? No, it doesn't make the game any harder or more fun. It just puts something useful further away. It makes it less convenient. That's it. Like, just because it's further away doesn't make it any harder to actually get to. It's just more time. So it's more more time wasted doing something useful, as opposed to, I don't know, time wasted trying to sort your inventory out. I, I just don't have the handgun ammo. And I, I, I'm like always getting more shotgun ammo. Yeah, 
And unfortunately, Leon doesn't get anything like the SMG. No, I, I, I really don't need to shoot this guy. I can't go that way. I can't go that way. Shooting that guy would make my life easier, but I can't afford it. I literally can't afford it. I come back in to see Leon eating shit. Yeah, as he tends to. Like, at least putting zombies in the main room, like, I understand, because, like, yeah, that does make the game harder. It does. I don't necessarily like it, but it makes the game harder, at the least. Um, but taking the item box and typewriter out of the main room, it doesn't, it doesn't make it any harder. It just makes this game so much more annoying to play during all the RPD segments. It's also entirely unnecessary for how little of the second runs are spent in the RPD. Uh, I'd say like less than half of the second run is RPD. Do I have any? Uh... No, I don't. Alright, so I'm gonna need that. How did I get here? Alright. Whatever. Once we get past uh, RPD, things are gonna be basically the exact same, so... At least there's that. So, where to? I have to remember. Right, I remember a couple of things I can do. Uh, there's the, uh... I, I can open a club key door past the meeting room. That might be a hit. I shouldn't have come down the stairs. E even if I didn't get hit, that was still a risk I shouldn't have taken. So yeah, past the waiting room, there's going to be a club key door. Uh, but there's also going to be liquors in here now, if I recall correctly. I'm going to want to be careful. Yeah, there's two. I literally left clicked on this door and it didn't open it, so now I'm gonna get hit. If it actually did my input, I would've been fine. Other issues between uh, Claire's run and Leon's run is this being way harder for Leon. Like, this this specific segment is so much more difficult for only Leon. Yeah. 
That's so annoying. This, not, not this room specifically, but the fact that he has to actually go through the room. Claire doesn't. Claire doesn't have to go through that room again. You can just... Uh, this... I might be dead. On our, uh, straight up, I might be dead. Uh, yeah, I'm... I'm not dead. Because I can do this. That's the only reason. If there's another one, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. But I couldn't have done anything there. So now I have to go back to the latest save, wherever the fuck that was. I don't like the second run at all. I don't like doing them. That's why most of my saves are single or A runs. It's because the second runs are literally just the game, but annoyingly hard. It's not an actual challenge. It's just they spam enemies, they get rid of important things for you, they get rid of item boxes and typewriters. Uh, there's like a million liquors and dogs. It's so much less fun. It's annoying. It's the worst kind of difficulty. It, lazy difficulty. Because, like, none of this is hard. Okay, that take that back. None of this is a challenge. None of this is well thought out or forces me to think my actions through. Like, that room with two liquors and, like, seven zombies? That's not... That's just not... You can't think your way through that. There's no feasible way to actually get through it without just a shit ton of healing items. Because combining the two doesn't work. Against the zombies, you have to move fast. Against the liquors, you have to move slow. If you don't... If you do one or the other, you're gonna take damage no matter what. There's no, like, smart your way through it. It's just not feasible. So, unless you have a shit ton of sub-weapons or healing items, you literally just can't get through it. And it wouldn't be so bad if there was some sort of method to avoid having to deal with one or the other. And there isn't. Uh, but, if, for example, the reason there were so many zombies in that room was because I left a window unboarded, at least it would be my fault. But it's not. If you board up the window, they'll still spawn all the zombies. Regardless. All, the, all that boarding the window does will avoid one zombie getting in. It's not fun. Um, Alright, so I have three flashbangs there. That also makes things annoying because you can't move slowly against the tyrant as well. They they just need to pick one or the other in terms of actually designing the level. They they need to pick enemies you move quickly against or enemies you move slowly against. Mixing them all at once does not work with this game. It, it's not that it's, like, too hard, it's just not how the game or enemies were designed. Now is if I do a flash grenade, maybe it'll do that. It just barely stops the liquor from hitting me. But like Jesus. Alright, so 
these guys, I really don't have any tools to deal with. Um, it kind of sucks. That's just part of playing as Leon, though, is you really do not have the tools to deal with the things that you need to deal with. Granted, I do like his weapons more, but the grenade launcher is just so much more useful. Like, if you don't have the grenade launcher, you immediately lose, like, 80% of your actual ability to stop the enemies. Oops. It, it, it was just too important. And the thing about it is, like, theoretically speaking, I do actually have what I need to stop an enemy. That's the problem. Because I have... Uh, I have the Lightning Hawk, and I have Magnum Ammo. That'll stop one enemy, though. That will not stop all of them. And when they're, like, throwing this many of the same type of enemy, it's like... I mean, what can I really do? I only have so much. Alright, uh, I, oh, I remember. I need to go... All the way up. Uh, fuck me. Yeah, like, what was I supposed to do there, for example? <laughs> you know? I, I was trying to bait the zombie into swinging. It just wasn't. It just didn't want to. This is why I, I don't play second runs, because it's just enemy spam. But I'll get through it, I'll get through it. Ah! Those guys I should have I, I should have remembered they were there. like a personalized email from the developers of this game to explain to me what the fuck just caused that liquor to attack me. As far as I'm aware from the things that this game has taught me on how to play the game, there was literally no reason for that to happen. understand if I bumped into the liquor. If if you bump into a liquor, it'll attack you because it'll know you're there, but I didn't. It was on the ceiling. true. Honest to god, I actually don't know why zombies bite people in this game. Like, because here's the thing. These aren't, like, zombies as we know them. That, that's kind of like the thing with Resident Evil, is that these aren't undead people. They aren't, like, hungry zombies. They just are. <laughs> and I'll, I'll say that again, just to clarify. No, these are not dead people brought to life. That's not what these guys are. The T-Virus does not reanimate corpses. They're just called zombies. For Hope I don't have reason. to write a report on this. Yo, 
Yo. Right, I know exactly why zomb the zombies bite people and look like reanimated corpses. It's because when Resident Evil 1 came out, that's what they were. And then they added stor the story to it. But, all things considered, they probably shouldn't. Uh, the zombies in this game probably shouldn't bite people. Uh, don't know why zombie media is too uptight to call their zombies zombies. Uh, well to be fair, this game does call them zombies. Uh, but they're, they're, I, I agree. I don't like any zombie media that doesn't call them zombies. That, that was one of my biggest issues with Walking Dead and anything Walking Dead adjacent is because it's just, it's just annoying. <laughs> It's annoying to hear them be referred to as something other than literally the one thing that we always hear them referred to as. Like, I understand that the Walking Dead universe is supposed to be set in a place that doesn't have any of the pop culture uh, that we have, so they wouldn't have known about zombies. Just call them zombies. <laughs> No liquor in this one. Uh, that's that would just. Did I hear you talking about super auto pets at some point? No. Okay. It only just dawned on me that I completely Silva! missed no! all these. Silva, no. Silva, no. What's Silver doing? Cable. No. I, I, it only just dawned on me. I straight up missed one of those. I, sh I should have another spare part by this point. Or another uh, spare key by this point. At least I think. It makes sense to me if I had it already. Okay, he is not. No! What a bad boy! Oh yeah, he's being a bad boy. <sighs> oh, I know where I can get the last one. I completely forgot that I never went and got the lemon room. Me too, Bestie. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how he got this much dirt on him when we've been in a building. There's a difference between dust and dirt, though. There we go. Oh, no, we still have a diamond. Left. There it is.
I can't imagine anyone ever getting those open without brute forcing them. <laughs> I'll admit, that's all I'm doing. I'm just brute forcing them. Are here. I forgot. This. Yeah, that was fair. For for context, there, what happened is uh, I got hit, stunned. Because when you take damage in this game, you get stunned. You're not allowed to move. You're not allowed to shoot. You're not allowed to open your inventory. So I got hit, got stunned. Then while I was stunned, I got hit again and killed. And if you want to know, no, there wasn't anything I could have done about that. There's literally no way I could have saved myself in that situation, apart from remembering every single bullshit spawn in this game. Like, even if I'd thrown a flashbang in preparation, I it wouldn't have exploded in time. So no, there was nothing I could have done there. Are there liquors in RE3? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. <sighs> How much bullshit do I have to re-fucking do? I have to go all the way back down here again. This is why. This is why. This is why them removing typewriters should never be a thing. Because I've lost progress, and it, for what? Like, what purpose is there for them to have done that? artificially lengthening their game, maybe they should have just added more content from the original game that they cut. If they cared that much about the length of this game. <laughs> so now I have to just redo this shit. Oh yes, uh, the Resident Evil remakes cut a shitload of content. Uh, Resident Evil 2, I believe, cut hours of progress. I believe uh, there were several points where you played as Ada that got cut, for example. There, there is a point in uh, Leon's story where you play as Ada, but it's not very long. Uh, not only that, though, uh, Resident Evil 3 remake cut like twice as much as that. The Resident Evil 3 remake is like four hours long. Uh, Resident Evil 3 Nemesis is, like, two or three times the length of Resident Evil 3 Remake. It's actually... It, it was, like, a big controversy about how much content was cut from the Resident Evil 3 Remake. Um, but this game, as well, was just as bad. Well, not just as bad, but, like, about as bad. <laughs> there's, there's so much cut content from the original Resident Evils that not only pissed off gamers, but also wouldn't have didn't really need to be cut I guess is the best way to describe it like I don't know I, I can't give like many examples uh, I know in uh, the original Resident Evil 2 there is a scene where uh, Ada and Annette Birkin actually talk face to face and that was cut for no real reason uh, it didn't need to be I, I, I can't give you many other examples but I can give you one I can give you a lot of examples for Resident Evil 3, uh, but, you know, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Uh, 
Alright, this time I'll memorize every single enemy spawn in the game. That way I don't get killed by something I wasn't looking at. Just remember all this arbitrary shit. Uh, no, we literally don't know. We literally don't know why it was cut. Presumably these games were just rushed. That would be my guess. But it wouldn't surprise me to find out that they were. I have no proof of it, and I wouldn't, like, actually exclaim that this game was rushed, but... Uh, my other... Actually, no, I do have another explanation. It's because the original... The, the people who wrote this game didn't... Didn't know the story of the original games. That's not, like, an exaggeration or a mean statement. It's something that we know for a fact is true. Uh, the, the people who uh, made these games uh, are on record as saying that they had to look at the Wikipedia article for certain Resident Evil games, and that's what they based their stories on. Uh... Not a good look. <laughs> if you want to be on, like, Resident Evil fans' side, that's not a very good look. Um, it's just... How do I put this? Uh, no, sorry. Two, well, first off, 203. There's also 102 and 103. It's just a little pathetic, in my opinion. To not even look at the Resident Evil wiki. <laughs> No, Wikipedia itself. Because I, I would never expect, like, the developers to know everything about these games. Like, that's absurd. The games are, like, over a decade old. There's no way the same people are working on it as used to. I am accepting of that fact. What I'm not accepting of is that the best place for them to find out what they were writing based off was Wikipedia. That I will not accept as true. Because I don't think I should. Yes, they got they they got the plot synopsis on Wikipedia, and that's what they founded these games on. And honestly, I wish I was being mean when I say that. <laughs> I wish that I was being like a a, a, a mean asshole. I'm not. <laughs> I'm literally stating facts. What the fuck? What? Big mosquito? They beat the shit out of me. Yeah, of course they beat the shit out of you. Another two win body. Silver, what are you doing? So 
Silver! You bastard! What's he doing? He's playing with the cable again. To pick him up and what? toss him on the bed. I yell at him and know he's leaving. Alright, that's fine. It's fine, he's being a bad boy. Let me reassign that to three. Alrighty. Well, that has to be that direction. Because that has to be that direction. That has to be in that direction. So it has to be that direction, and that has to be that direction. So that goes there, that goes there, that goes there. He doesn't want pets. He's chewing and playing with the cable. He's just being naughty. Yeah, no, he, he just wants to bite the cables. to do something that I literally never do. Oh shit. Ah, give me a break. I'm not in the position to actually be hit though. Do I not? I didn't bring a flashbang. I need to get grabbed, pop a knife, and then just book it in this direction and hope I'm not getting body blocked. You're keeping score. Look, this isn't a game. Oh, you're gonna kill me. Nothing dies down here. I take it you have the key card. Yeah, and this. I was hoping you could explain what's on it. Maybe. I hear it. Let's get out of here. the intel you needed? Unfortunately, no. <clears throat> ben didn't come through. Well, what exactly are you looking for? More info on the people responsible for this mess. Uh. 
Of all the places that don't look like a city, it's this city. Ugh. Roads out. Going through that gun shop looks like the only way. <clears throat> See that letter again? Yeah, that's the one from Jill. Anyway, speaking of random guys with better voice acting. Don't move. I'm not gonna hurt you. I said don't move. I'm just passing through. I'm gonna ask you to lower that weapon. I kill you off. You gotta turn around and go right back out the way you came in. I think your daughter needs help, sir. Don't tell me how to deal with my daughter. Drop it. No! Wait! Step aside. We need to terminate her before she turns. Terminate? It's my fucking daughter. Ada. Just let them be. Emma? Sweetheart, I told you to stay put. Daddy. Daddy's here. Okay. Those fucking things hurt so much. What they did to us. You're a cop. You're supposed to know something. How did this happen? Huh? She was our sweet little angel. Mommy. I was sleeping, honey. Okay. And I'm gonna put you to bed too, okay? Privacy. You know, it's one thing to keep the truth from me, but why him? I want to find out what's happening here and stop whoever's behind it. Helping people like them? That's why I joined the force. My mission is to take down Umbrella's entire operation. We may not make it out. Whatever it takes to save this city, count me in. Past this point, I'm pretty sure the game is basically going to be identical to what the it would be in an Aeron. They have a virus. It turns people into indestructible monsters. That explains the horrible things I've seen. Fuck that cutscene, by the way. <laughs> Fuck that cutscene, it's too good. Um, and also they didn't even go all out. <laughs> And that's why I'm looking for Annette Birkin. She's the one at Umbrella responsible for unleashing the virus. I'm going to bring her down. <clears throat> like, by all means, they should absolutely have had a second gunshot there, but they didn't add it because they understood that that would be going too hard. 
This is how we get to Annette. Based on what you've said, the sewer seems fitting. Well said. After you. Gee, thanks. Don't, don't, don't send two. I can't imagine a real scientist <laughs> like being too down much here. like a person. This leads right into Umbrella's secret facility. Come on, sewers are run by the city. How could they have a facility without the authorities knowing? Welcome to corporate America. Umbrella's controlled Raccoon City for years. Jesus! That an earthquake? I sure as hell hope so. Uh. What the hell? Stay sharp. God only knows what's down there. Alright, well, I'm literally never gonna need that. Uh, I'll take the flashbang. Uh, I'm running low on sub weapons, to be fair. Sure, this is the right way. Unfortunately. Wait there. on that you overgrown son of a bitch so yeah a gator gator His voice acting isn't much better. No. Can't say I didn't warn you. Uh, you said the virus turned people into monsters, not reptiles. Fair point. I'm just impressed you made it in one piece. Uh. The Clara really does have like the good voice acting. No uh. man does it. Let me get this straight. Umbrella sells monsters like that to who? Our military? Somebody else's? They don't sell the monsters. They sell the viruses that make them. And Annette is who makes the viruses. As scary as that alligator was, Annette is far more dangerous. yourself. Annette Birkin. She's who we're looking for? Not much time. Need to dispose of it. 
We're here for the G virus. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. I'm warning you, Doctor. Oh, yeah? Hey! Stop! Stop. Ada! Yeah. Uh. You'll never get the G virus! I didn't expect that from a scientist. Uh. Leon. Forget about me. Just go. Stop her before she gets away. Oh. The telltale random clo cloth ruffle to indicate that someone changed clothes. I'm right outside the facility in pursuit of Annette. Not on her. It must be in the nest. Once it's in hand, I'll call for extraction. You can run, Annette, but you can't hide. I can hear Silver crying, but I honestly have no idea why. Yeah, he does that. All right. Secret weapon time. Okay. No. Candy from a baby. Bro, where'd you get a 4549 ant? <laughs> Bro, why'd you get a 4549 ant? With melon armor. <sighs> Wiped out the whole dang squad. Yeah, of course it did. literally nothing back there. Okay. Oh, I didn't know that you could get a flashbang Zeta. Probably did know that, and I just never noticed. Uh, where do you go again? I don't quite recall. There it is. Always been good at running, Annette. Give me that. Persistent bastard, aren't you?
<laughs> You're right, that kind of did sound like a basketball. I didn't quite hear it. I was too busy focusing. I don't know, Tyrant's fucking ballin', dude. <laughs> He's fucking ballin'. Bravo. Gonna burn me alive now? You'll never get your filthy hands on the G. I'm not the only one after it. You realize that? And you won't die alone. Alrighty, let's see. Visitor clearance confirmed. Your ID is authorized until October 1st. Please return before this date. Not yes. gonna happen. Okay, well, am I allowed to go this way? Well, that's literally a dead end for no reason. So I just said, oh, you know. No. I most certainly do not. Enough with this cat and mouse game. The game is over. You lost. Tell me, is your husband still alive? Or did you kill him so you could take credit for G? Interesting theory. You don't cooperate. I'll get a sample from the nest. Over my dead body. Every time. Every time. Anytime he even thinks of her. Ada? Damn it. They really are the straight couple for gay people. Um. Ada? The yeah. Where are you? I don't think there's anything back here for me. Well, guess not. I've got so much. Can, can, can we be honest? 
Depends. And that's way prettier than I remember. <laughs> Uh, no, the shotgun has to be on too. No. All right, yeah, fine. It's whatever. I I I don't remember her being this pretty, but it's man. the morally neutral at best and at worst woman. <laughs> yeah. She's a very fun antagonist. Eh, she's hardly even an antagonist. Yeah, that's true. That's a pleasant smell. He was always sassy. He was just also baby back then. Yeah, he was stupider. <laughs> no, no, I, no, no, he wasn't. He was smarter. Yeah, no, he he gets stupider. He he gets himbified. Yeah. Considering he gets way more Jack in in the later games. He, he gets yeah. The difference though is that like. He always respected women. Well, yeah, okay, that's not at all what I was going to no, say. No, I'm just saying. Because I thought that went without saying. I'm, I'm just saying it. Uh, the difference is that they start treating him like someone who actually wants to work for the government. I kind of forgot they did that. Yeah, I think it's in like 6 or maybe something after they act like Leon would ever want to work for the government or believe what the government's doing is right. What the... Why did he say that? Uh, he just has- that's just part of his random dialogue whenever he's near a zombie. Yeah. So you can just randomly go, WHAT THE?! Yeah. <laughs> she do be an ice queen? Straight facts. Uh, you stand up eventually. And now I you get won't. up! You, however... Follow me, you dumb idiot. Oh, I'm not gonna flashbang him, I'm not the fucking SWAT. All I'm gonna say is, what the fuck will did William do? Wasn't that Honk you just passed? No, 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 no. Okay, so fine. here's the thing. So, the what you saw Honk is a standard issue gear for the USB-C. Actually, no, I don't think it's for the USB-C, it's for a different, uh... Uh, a different squad of uh, the Umbrella Corps. I think it's, it's just the Umbrella Corps. Um, they all look the same. The difference is that Hunk survives. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It was mostly just him going, Stop! If you ever see someone who's, like, very wounded or dead, it's not Hunk, he's fine. Dude. Yeah, Hunk, Hunk is notable in that he, he's fine. He, he, do, he doesn't get hurt. Well, I mean, he gets hurt a little bit. He gets hurt, but he doesn't die. Yeah, no, he, he'll, he'll always be fine. Oh, I'm, I'm still sad they didn't bring him back in Village. I'm still, yeah. I'm still sad about it. They literally brought back the Mercenaries game mode and then made it Ugh. shit. Like, where the fuck is Honk? What is it with me and characters that have separate game modes that are way harder? I can only think of like one other example. try this. I don't know if it'll work. I did it something. Did. What the hell? I'm not gonna worry about what was behind me. I can actually go past him now. That was a mistake. <laughs> uh, I can't afford to get poisoned right now, so I'm gonna have to just take that L.
I didn't mean to do that. I literally didn't press that button. Uh, he might barely be set up. I think he's barely set up. Cable car. Interesting. Alright, so you don't actually come through here that often as Leon, but that doesn't matter because there's literally no zombies. Why are there no zombies here? There's, there wasn't Claire's run. Oh yeah, of course. Uh, I don't think you have to really go through that place very often as, uh, as Leon, but it's still worth doing just in case I do. sound of that. Sip every time he just goes, Ada. <laughs> yeah, but do that any game. I mean, yeah, exactly. That's just that's just Leon. Okay. I really don't have enough shit. Oh, actually, do I have another blue orb? Yes, I do. I have that one. So we're not quite to the fuck it segment yet, but we will be soon. The fuck it segment? Yeah, f the fuck it segment. Which one is that again? Uh, you'll see. If I... So we get another red herb here, which is very, very convenient. Because I literally fucking require it. All that's down there is the note for the safe. Honestly, the stock could do nothing and I would still get it. I do. Uh, I have them in the box, though. Uh, we, we have to go this way before I head to the fuck it section. I don't think we have to, but I'm going to.
I don't think I have much reason to actually come in here apart from just straight up loot. Uh, I don't think there's any reason to do this during a rerun. Apart from if you need to go back to the police station for whatever reason. I don't. Let me collect it. here again. So now I just need to get the Queen and King piece, and that'll be it for this part.
Oh yeah, I got an S rank on Claire. Yeah, I heard. Yeah. Fuck yeah. What did you get for it? I have literally no fucking idea. Oh. It, if it was a model, I didn't notice what it was. Wow. The game wasn't 100% clear. And by that I mean I just didn't read it, so it's the game fault. It's fault. Oh, of course. I think I underestimated the, the fact that, that I was doing two campaigns. Fair. Yeah. Oh, is this the fuck it segment? Yeah, this is the fuck it segment. You just run Where you just run past him and say fuck it. If they grab you, it's like... Yeah, fuck yeah. What are they gonna do to me? I can't be poisoned. What? I can't be poisoned, so... Oh, you have to poison me. Yeah. Uh. Alright, what's the worst that they're gonna do? Alright, that guy's dead. Is this the end of the sewers? Um... Once we go, once we get back, yes. Okay. So there's not too much left. No, not at all. Okay, cool. I mean, that makes it sound like I, uh, like I, I wanted to get this over with. That's not what I mean. I know what you meant. It's just like man. <laughs> this is this has been all, this has been a an even bigger boy of a stream. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's funny that I say that considering I haven't been here for most of it this time. Yeah. But. That was always kind of a plan, was that I wouldn't spend too much time around on 2 and 3, just because uh, 2 I've experienced many times, 3... You've literally experienced it once. Did I experience it twice with you? You experienced it, sure, if you count Leon A and Claire, oh. er, Le Claire A and Leon B as experiencing it twice. I'm pretty sure we played through it again afterwards. I don't remember that. I do. I don't have the room to dodge these guys. I, at the very least, very vividly remember this game. Alright, well, yeah. Alright, chemical burn flamethrower is very, very important. And arguably, uh, a million times better than what you fucking get as Claire. I'm sure, like, if anyone, if, if like, RE fans watch this, they'd be like, I'm actually yeah, uh, the spark gun, the stun sp bolt and spark gun is uh, really, really good if you use it like this. Bro, just shoot him. Did you, um, did you get the, did you kill one more zombie with it? Yeah, I got, I got the achievement. Okay, cool. Like, bro, I don't give a fuck if the spark whatever is super good or whatever. It ain't. <laughs> Just shoot him. Uh, like I'll I'll show you something way more effective. Boot. Your your right click and left click. That tends to kill them faster than hold right click, then hold left click over them, and then like the longer you hold left click, the more damage it does. I but want you to know that if someone was here, they'd be so mad at you for wasting that shot. I literally don't care. Look at oh. how much ammo I have. Oh, I know, but like, you know someone would be like, How dare you waste your ammo? You never know when you might need it. It's like, no. I, I, I know, I do know when I, I might need it. Now. What's that guy doing up? You're literally not supposed to be here. But whatever. I don't. 
I didn't end up having to use any of the things I brought for the fuck it segment, so it's fine. Oh shit, I know where we are now. Uh, I remember this when we played the fourth survivor like six, like seven hours ago. Yeah. <laughs> Almost. Can't, can't you unlock like ten different characters through the fourth survivor? Through fourth survivor you can unlock tofu and then by beating tofu you'll unlock another one then another one then another one then another one i believe there's five tofus i could oh yeah there's like i could have sworn there was like 10 of them but like no. i think that was just how it felt the first time it's just like <laughs> yeah, what no. the fuck <laughs> all right the rook's next to the knight but not facing the queen the king ain't next to the queen but facing the knight right at the end of the night the knight ain't where the case marking says so, the rook's next to the knight, but not facing the queen. The king's not next to the queen, but facing the knight. Uh, right at the end. But facing the knight right at the end. Alright, so the king's right at the end somewhere. Uh, so, it's either there or there. Um, the rook's next to the knight, not facing the queen. The king's not next to the queen, but facing the knight. Right at the end of the knight. Uh, fuck. means that the king has to be here, the knight has to be here, the, uh, hold on, let me see that again, the rook's next to the knight but not facing the queen, the king ain't next to the queen but facing the knight right at the end, and the knight ain't where the case marking says. only have the rook and the queen left, so this is wrong. Presumably I don't touch these two. I don't see a way how this could be possible without touching them. Without fucking with them. There would be no place for them otherwise, as far as I'm aware. Um, the rook's not facing. <laughs> the pawn has to be here. That's all there is to it, uh, which means that it has to be these two. So the knight has to be here. King has to be here. Uh, it doesn't say anything about the bishop having to be there. So the king ain't next to the queen, but facing the knight right at the end, and the knight ain't with the king. Alright, so the rook's next to the knight. So, rook me. Bishop me. Queen me. Almost there, Ada. And I'm gonna say, just so I have to do. I don't have to do that again. Yeah, I've got enough. Uh, I actually, I might have more mag ammo in my item box that I've been leaving there for no purpose. Yes, I had four more rounds. Jesus 
Christ! I didn't know you could squeeze past him immediately. Ah, shit. I left sub weapons in the item box, actually. That could be problematic. No, I get grabbed at any point. Alright. Yeah, just, uh, you know, just dodge on this tiny platform. I, I hate this fight. I think this. I, I, I mentioned it while you were. I think asleep. I think this fight is like the weakest part of G. I think it's incredibly unfun and un imbalanced. That's fair. I, I like the fight conceptually, but that's fair. There's not enough space. Yeah. And he has. I think the. What the fuck is he doing? I think the. Uh, this thing takes a little bit too long to get over here for it to be fun. Yeah. And to actually feel like in your control. Uh, this is a. I'm dead. I'm, purely, I'm only dead because he grabbed me. That's why I don't like this fight. No, that's that's fair. It's it's not the best. It's it's a lot of things out of your control. I think when I first saw it, especially, I was like, "Damn, bro, that's cool." And it's it's imp it's it's flashy, but not much else. That was a waste of a shot. But... Nope. I'm not gonna get the chance to push the button again. That was stupid. Now I got you. Uh I think with how far away he is, this is a guarantee. He's just gonna stand there. It's because I have done. I, I did enough damage to him to stun him. That's how this works. <sighs> ah, I shouldn't have done that. Look at how long this takes. It's literally just sitting Let's there. Do this. <sighs> All right. The main issue with last time is that I was doing it as Claire, and there's literally no easy way to fight bosses as Claire. Does she not get a shotgun? No. Of course not. She gets a grenade launcher instead, and the grenade launcher is terrible. Because you can't hit weak points with it. Let's hope that's the last of them. there for a sec. I can't get it out. I don't know if I should die. Just do it. I can't walk like this. Okay. It's gonna hurt. <sighs> Hold on. I can do it myself. Just relax, okay? So, what 
we do now? Get yourself out of here. While you still can. I'm not just gonna leave you. Not like this. You don't understand. The situation's worse than I thought. You're not getting rid of me that easy. You protected me. Now it's my turn. I didn't realize we were keeping score. Grab my shoulder. Don't push it, rookie. I'm okay, just trying to help. Watch your step. Just, just leave the hydrogen peroxide. You want to help? We have to get to the nest. Nest? Umbrella's lab, right beneath us. Net, let it slip. That's where the virus samples are. You up for this? I think I could fit it in my schedule. Come on. We got work to do. Yes, ma'am. You ever, like, make a bottom? <laughs> yeah. The cable car will take us down to Nest. My wristbands, I'll take it to ride. Nice. Where'd you get that? Borrowed it. Anyway, we're almost there. <laughs> What's up? What's wrong? I'm just imagining Anna's, like, turning around and just seeing this. Why do you keep doing that? Uh, doing what? What am I doing? That's weird. <laughs> yeah, alright. What, what am I what, what am I doing that's strange? Damn leg. Let me carry you. No. That only make me feel worse. At least if I if, at least playing as Claire, you get to go at your own speed, but like if I start running, she's not gonna move any faster. Worse than it looks. What a pair. Both got one foot in the grave. I have to wonder, if I hadn't killed that zombie, would they have gotten rid of him? That way Ada couldn't be attacked. I've never considered that. Usually there is a zombie in here. Spawns over there by the safe, and once you pick up the blue herb, he'll activate. Wait, I have a flashbang? Here, here we are. Oh, yeah. I was thinking, I can't wait for the FBI to raid Umbrella Headquarters and take those bastards to justice. I agree, but to be clear, you're not working in official capacity. This is a federal case. Once we get the G-Virus, I'm back on my own. Hey, Leon, trust me? Trust me? <laughs> Honestly, if I didn't, you'd probably be dead. Right. I thought I might need your help, and I was right. If you can secure the G-Virus, I can make sure what happened in Raccoon City never happens again. Ada, you say it yourself. It's a federal case. I Leon, don't have the authority. look at me. I'm a liability now. If I'm going to finish this case, you're the last hope I've got. I'm not just going to leave you here. What if you're attacked? What if you need help? Don't worry about me. I gotta see this through. And I want to see you again. I got plenty to live for, trust me. Now, arriving at Ness. Go. Please, we don't have much time. You're gonna need this. Okay. Leon, counting on you. I know. I get to play the game again.
we're getting close to the end. Uh, Ness doesn't tend to take too long. It, it should take like 20 minutes, 30 minutes maybe. Something like that. Safety. Stand clear until the doors are fully open. For your safety, stand clear until the doors are fully open. I really wanted it to go safety. up. Stand clear until the doors. Welcome to Nest. Yeah. Enjoy your visit. Okay. I wonder where the G-Virus is. Alright, that's useless now. Uh, the D's virus. Not after D's, that is. <laughs> oh, I can't wait, Dave, don't. What's his accent? What accent does Heisenberg have? Uh, I think it's called gay. <laughs> That's not an accent. It's his it's accent. It's a speech pattern. His accent is fruity. I don't know. <laughs> I told you that's not an accent. It's a speech pattern. No, I pattern. know. I know. <laughs> I don't know, but it's strange. It it feels like a mix. It it genuinely feels like a mix of a British person trying to do an American accent. Like an overly exaggerated one, and an American trying to do a British accent. It's not it's an American not trying to do a British accent. Uh, it just feels like a weird fusion of both, to the point where it just doesn't come out as it either. Please enjoy our tasty selection of healthy foods. Stop! Fucking die! Jesus Christ, how hard is that? I'm not being that unreasonable, unreasonable with my requests. Whatever. Whatever loot's in here is not worth it, so I don't give a shit. I didn't hear loot the first time. Like the, the I first didn't say lewd. I, I, listen, I didn't quite hear you over the zombies, alright? Alright, get the big gunpowder. Big gun. Don't get my ass fucked by this asshole. Nice. Especially considering you literally never even use the flamethrower before you get here. <laughs> Unless you're like curious about how it works. Presence is urgently requested. Alright. There's a save point literally right here for no reason not to. Apart from, you know, losing time, which I'm very clearly not afraid of. Yeah. Horse Plinko is the number one thing trending on Tumblr right now. <laughs> yeah, that's because people have been making a lot of horse Plinko jokes. this horse when they least expect it. <laughs> OSS.
I don't recall uh, how you get more ammo for the flamethrower without finding it, and by that I mean that's literally the only way to get it, is you have to find it. But I don't recall where you're finding it. Is I think what I'm trying to say. I'm wrong, of course, in which case I do think there's stuff over there. easier to kill them as Leon, but god if it doesn't take more fucking time. Alrighty, so I need to grab this. I think I remember one of the passcodes uh, you have to put in. One of the passcodes you have to put in here was two zero nine seven. All right, two seven nine one. What is zero? Uh, must change. So be it. I don't really mind. I didn't hit. You just gotta hit the mangoes. The mangoes. Ah, oh, shit. Five, eight, three, one. 
Did you know that these equated the numbers? I mean, it's organized like a keypad, so it makes sense. I just didn't really think about it that way. Most people don't. Most people just look at symbols and go, uh... No, my no, my only thing is that it would take a lot of effort for me to remember which symbol is in which number. Uh, each symbol is has blank space that uh, looks like the number. Oh. And by that, I, and by that, I mean you really gotta like stretch your imagination to actually see it like that. But it's there. Yeah. Oh, should we hit the seven hour mark? Uh, yep. Earth. Classic sound effect. My peepees. Doctor Peep. No, don't put the signal modulator away. Put the fucking knife away. fuel. Alright, uh, do I have any other gunpowder large? I don't think so. I do! Still says BRB. I thought I thought yeah, they came back. Burb. Yeah, no, I thought they came back and just said bro. Fucked up. Alright, lick your time. <laughs> yep. Just go through. Uh, where's the trophy? There it is. Uh alright. Five oh that fuck's sake. Yeah, I had the right numbers, just in the wrong order. So it's two, seven. That's a seven? Yeah, it's it's weird. So two, seven. I think that's a six, and then an eight. Yeah, two, seven, six, eight. I just got a thing against legs, dude. I'm the opposite of a foot fetishist. You need to go. Hey, sorry, bro, but you need to not be there. Someone in the head. No. <laughs> Alternatively, they can just completely like negate their threat, their sense of threat, by leaving. Oh, wrong way. I know there's a, an achievement for beating this game without using the item box. Hell. What did I say? Two seven six eight. Yeah. Right. I'm 
I'm still losing my mind over the seven though. Like it dead ass looked like an O to me. Yeah. Try not to think about it too hard. <laughs> not all of the negative space is the number, but the number is the negative space. Two, seven, six, eight. No? It is two oh six eight. I think it was actually that one. Four eight. <laughs> Nah, that's dead. That's an O. Is it? Alright. And then the bottom one was thick. So, yeah. Alright. 2048. Oh, shit! I'm so glad that I literally just used the special gunpowder and now I'm getting like a large gunpowder. Anyway, time to do this shit again. Manual mode engaged. Adjust amount of solution to match cartridge capacity. This puzzle so much. This puzzle looks fucking. It shit. sucks. Welcome back. Hey, it's this again. I hate this puzzle so much. It's I. It's so annoying. So fucking close. I hate this puzzle. Wait, actually. Oh, you missed a good amount.
I do this? Is this just gonna be like... Yeah, it's... I fucking hate this puzzle. smaller number all oh, right yeah come on register my a please god I hate this puzzle it's so not fun I just hate most Resident Evil puzzles I think Resident Evil puzzles manage to stand alone as some of the least fun puzzles in gaming. I literally don't know what I'm doing wrong. No, didn't press that. I still didn't press that. as far as I'm aware. Now we need to cool it. Oh, sorry, that was back here. Son of a bitch.
really? Whatever, last time I ever have to do that. Unless I play through this game again, which I don't think I will anytime soon, at least. Okay, yeah, of course they added the now. to the cold room? Uh, left. I very barely missed. Welcome back, Dr. Lee. You have five new messages. <sighs> Who left the freezer open? Alright, I left an ivy here, so I need to be incredibly careful. At a certain point, I feel like people would start to question why I choose to kill so many zombies when I could literally just not. But at, 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 at a certain point, you just, like, what you save in your ammo for next game? Like, I've got 31 shotgun shells. Of course I'm gonna start killing these guys. Yeah. I wish I grabbed a sub-weapon from the item box, actually. Dispensing solution now. <clears throat> I don't think there should be any other IVs back here. Usually the one that's on the ceiling will drop down by now, but I've already killed him. Alright, so we don't have much left. Uh, we got the fight against G stage 3, I think it is. G stage 3. Uh, then we got Super Tired, then G stage 5. I forgot to actually press this. 
Not that G stage 5 is really much of a fight, especially as Leon. Stretch. Yeah, basically. Uh, no red herbs, so I, I sleep. Yeah, alright. Actually, uh, I'll take another full heal, just in case. Wait, where's, where's the typewriter? Better be here. It's not. Developers. Where's my typewriter? I'll, I'll, I'll backtrack in case I missed it. Might I erase my point again? it is. Uh, more shotgun ammo? Oh, you shouldn't have. But I mean, you absolutely should have, and I would have been upset if you didn't, after giving me a large... We're basically almost done. Huh. That was easy. All right. Now back to Ada. Tell me you weren't involved in this. Yes. But we never meant for this to happen. Then tell me everything. Right from the start. <coughs> you don't get away that easily. Done. It's 
so you made this monster. We made the G-Virus, but we never intended this... You can spin it any way you want. You're still responsible. <laughs> It's a shame that this isn't the final form of G. Um, Alright, I didn't have the best grip of my movement there, but... It happens. naturally means that I'm gonna risk it. I think he tried to grab me. Thank you. Uh, where is it? Am I missing something? Oh, yeah, I'm missing something. Here, and I think that's everything. Using that. <laughs> well, just missed completely. Nice fucking throw, Leon. <laughs> Way to really overhand it. Oh, I don't want to be here. I don't think I've ever had that hit before. I should have stopped. 
stood there? I don't know. destroy that G sample. No, it's evidence. It's going to the FBI. <laughs> you trust that bitch? What's that supposed to mean? She's not FBI. She's a mercenary. She's gonna sell it. G virus is gonna go to the highest bidder. the videotape right now. <laughs> I was just thinking about you. That makes two of us. I was getting worried. You know, we make a good team. I gotta ask you something. Way's clear. Please. Tell me you got it. Oh, I got it. Let me verify the G sample when we get the hell out of here. Before we do that, I ran into Annette. She claims you're not FBI. Oh, Leon. Why couldn't you just hand over the sample? Because I realized, as much as I wanted to trust you, I didn't. I really hoped it wouldn't end up like this. So that's all this was? I was just some pawn to you? Look, I'm just doing my job. And I'm doing mine, so drop that damn gun! I'm taking you in. Hand over the sample, Leon. I don't want to hurt you. And you shoot me. But I don't think you can. yourself, Leon. No!
time limit time. <laughs> Not another time crunch. It's a 10 minute time crunch though. You could literally never run out of time. There, I cannot see a world where you run out of time here. Place is coming down. Listen to me. You need to get out fast. Yeah. There's a way out. Yeah, she's a lot meaner in this it? route, but you know. Where are you now? Justifiably. Claire, are you still there? Leon. Hey, Leon, you're breaking up. Forget about me. Just get out of here. Damn it. Nine minutes. A knife? I don't think I'll need that. <laughs> then again, there might be IVs, and if there are IVs, it's always worth having some weapons. Uh, he won't be able to grab me. Uh, if he didn't walk forward, he would have been able to. Never mind, he was still able to. Yeah.
think that hit me. here I'm pretty sure is survive. I don't think damage to him particularly matters. But in case it does, I don't exactly want to go get lacking in damage. This is bad. It's fine. actually miss her. Lehan? You made it. Just like I said we would. Who's this? This is Sherry. Okay. Jesus. What was that? I don't know. I'll go. You take care of Sherry. I don't think that knife is actually usable during this. <laughs> Get a 
problem with death? You want more bullets? Be my guest. Come on! Want some more? No, this is G. This is Birkin. We actually just met last night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that would have been one hell of a first date, though. Yeah, you have no idea. Look! He might be able to give us a ride. What if it's not just the city? Get Cherry out of here. over I don't know but if it's not we'll stop it whatever it takes yeah you damn right we will as long as we stick together we'll be fine come on hey you guys can adopt me <laughs> adopt uh. you <laughs> we can get a puppy a uh, puppy and a parrot I always wanted pets, but my mom said they're too messy. Huh. Next up on this boring Wednesday is a song to get your blood pumping. There we go, 140502. So what's the story behind the tyrant? Uh, the, the problem there is that there is a, there is a story behind the tyrants, plural though. Um, so you heard the T-Virus. You, you know that buzzword for this franchise. The T-Virus is a, is a viral agent developed by Umbrella Corporation that uh, is utilized to cause incredible cell growth and strength in whatever it's administered in. Um, so the T-Virus, when, in, uh, in, when humans are infected with it, uh, causes one of two transformations, essentially. Uh, the first transformation that the T-Virus causes is the zombie. The zombies are humans who were infected with the T-Virus, but not strong enough to actually mutate to become a tyrant. Uh, so the zombies are not reanimated corpses, it's humans who are infected by the virus, and their, uh, bodies, not, well, first and foremost, their bodies became way stronger. But they lost uh, brain processing power alongside uh, some levels of mobility, and their skin becomes all dead. Uh, the other transformation is you can become a tyrant, which is essentially just a superhuman. Uh, the T-Virus 
causes one main issue in that uh, they they lack some levels of intelligence. Uh, so that the tyrant we just dealt with is, I believe, either the T103 or the T00. I think it's the T00. Uh, they lack the mental capability to utilize weapons of any sort. Uh, so typically, they're deployed in situations where they need to kill witnesses. That's the point of the T-00s in Resident Evil 2. They're literally only in Raccoon City to kill people who might know that Umbrella was involved. That's it. Um, there, are very, there are a lot of other different tyrants, however. So the Tyrant 001 was in Resident Evil 1. That's the one that we killed there. That was just a tyrant. It was an attempt at making a tyrant. Uh, the, the, the tyrants are um, essentially mass-produced bioweapons. That's their only purpose. Uh, is that they, the, the virus can be sold to make these guys. Uh, it, it just so happened that Leon had to deal with the Super Tyrant, which uh, is a bit of an odd case. Um, the T-Virus, and especially the G-Virus, which are two very different things I should, uh, I should mention. The T-Virus is a rapidly mutating virus. That's why the Super Tyrant happened. Um, as for why it didn't happen earlier, you might have noticed uh, that the Tyrant is always wearing a big coat. That's not just for show. Uh, the big coat actually uh, prevents uh, mutation in order to keep the Tyrants from getting out of control. So that coat is literally like a power inhibitor. <laughs> and the moment they take the power inhibitor off, they go ape shit. So there's, there's your, your blast of lore about Resident Evil. We can skip the credits now. Oh, come on! I'm three minutes! I'm three minutes over S rank. If I didn't die one of those times. Oh my god. Fucked up. Fucked up. Alright. Well, that's that on that. <laughs> I have beaten Resident Evil 2 and twice. Twice. I beat it twice. Uh that was 8 hours, a little a little under 8 hours, longer than I expected, but I I should have probably taken into account that I'd be playing two storylines. Although, to be fair, I don't think it uh, actually took me 8 hours to beat both uh, my in-game time for both was not eight hours, is what I'm trying to say. So, I, I left the timer running during seconds that the game wouldn't have counted. I don't care. <laughs> uh, yeah, that puzzle also cost me the, the S rank. I, I, I hate the puzzle, though. I, I hate a lot of puzzles in Resident Evil. I think, I think in the early Resident Evils, the puzzles are the worst parts. Uh, like there, are, there are very, very few puzzles in early Resident Evil games that I think actually add to the game and make it more fun. Uh, but, whatever. Uh, that's The point of this wasn't for me to get s rank. The point of this was for me to do it. And I sure did it. And that sure was day two uh, of these streams. <laughs> yep, that, was, uh, that happened. Yep, it uh, sure did. It doesn't feel like it even happened, but I know it did factually. Yeah. <sighs> Hardly any resistance. I literally don't know what that was for. Uh, show me the story results. No. Let me. Uh, where do I see like my achievements? It's. Is it not in here? No. You. Is it in records? Is that what that is? Records. Oh. Yes, it is. Yeah. All right. So. What was it you got? Uh, we'll find it. It was uh. Hardly any resistance. Open the jail's electronic cell door in 10 moves. Okay, so I got concept art. Uh, I also got that one. Obtain, yeah. Uh, what, what did I get for uh, S-rank player? The Samurai Edge, and then Sizzling Scarlet Hero gets you Sherry. Okay. Yep. Well... I guess that's that for now. Uh, what do we need to do now? I need to take a shower and eat. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 
I, I've got a friend currently streaming right now, so I'll probably just host him. You don't have to stick around, though. Uh, it's it's just don't, 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 Yeah, don't feel obligated uh, in any way. Let me just uh, get to my... Tomorrow we'll be back with Resident Evil 3. Uh, that that will be short. Resident Evil 3 is going to be short. It should be a five hour stream, I, I guess. Nowhere near as long as today's. Um, but uh, I, I should probably mention that I need to, I'll be getting a, a vaccine shot scheduled for Wednesday. Uh, if I'm feeling up to it and we have the time on Wednesday, we might start Resident Evil 4. If not, I'm probably going to be taking Wednesday and Thursday off. Uh, I don't necessarily know that I'll be taking Thursday off, but I'm probably going to. Uh, j just for the sake of recovering from the COVID shot. So Wednesday and Thursday, don't expect me. But if I'm there, cool. So be it. Uh, but uh, until then... Uh, that that's that's all for now. Uh, so I'll just figure out how to host, and uh, then we'll we'll be off. Yeah. Um, where? How the hell do you host someone? Uh, uh, do you go to their Twitch and click a button? Or something? I don't, I don't no. think so. Maybe I I don't know. Uh, edit? No. Broadcast options. I'll find it. Uh. How to host on Twitch. <laughs> Don't mind me as I'm Googling. Alright, yeah. Okay, yeah, I can do that. Alright. Yeah. Alright, so that's all that I've got for now. So I'll I'll see you tomorrow. Peace. Later. <laughs>